The festive mood pervaded the entire atmosphere to the extent that our neighboring villages expressly felt the heat. They never stop in talking about it up to now as I speak with you. Really? I'm telling you. Exactly. You see, it was such an elaborate celebration. Could you imagine? My children that came down from the city have all refused to go back. Uh. We should have the ceremony never ended. <laughs> <laughs> That. Whatever that has a beginning also has an end. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> um, I am so impressed. Yes, yes. Uh, you all uh, enjoyed it. Uh, really, really enjoyed it. Igwe. Igwe. Uh, I think I personally enjoyed it more than every other person. Really? Yeah. I ardently was impressed to watch our princess dance on the last day of the celebration. What I I never knew our princess is such what a wonderful dancer. <laughs> Don't you know that Princess Ujunga has been a wonderful dancer right from her childhood? Wonderful! Hey! 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 Oh, I want to ask, yes. where have you been all this while? Everybody has been expecting you. <laughs> Igwe, you've asked me exactly the question God asked one of his angels in the white man's book one million years ago. <laughs> and I will give you the same answer. The angel answered God. What was the answer? God asked his angel, whence comest thou? <laughs> And his angel answered him, From going to and fro the earth. <laughs> I am coming from going to and fro your kingdom. <laughs> I shall answer you that question without looking at you. <laughs> My eyes are fixed on that new jeep your son, Ozomna, brought back for you for the New Year Festival. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we have to inform Mazi Ibe to prepare a special wine mm. because it comes for a special celebration. <laughs> <laughs> so, I want you to have your eyes. Your eyes are fixed on that new jeep. What he sees special in that Mazi Ibe's palm wine? I will answer that question. You have forgotten that Mazi Ibe is one of the best pan wine tapas we have in this land. That is for you. But for you, we because you cannot sleep without tasting that pan wine. Meaning that Your Majesty nobody talks. Don't even go there. Our Majesty the Papa is a thing.
Mama, you sent for me. My princess. Come, sit down, let's discuss. <sighs> Mother, why do you like this talk? Huh? If I don't disturb my princess, who then do I disturb? <sighs> Tell me. Akugo. Enenebe Jerelo. Akwa unwa. Okay, mother, stop. Stop yeah. flattering me. That's better. <laughs> now join me. Uh, uh, I don't want it. Look, you better keep this your young girl by the side. Especially now that your fiancé is back in town. I'm sure he will soon come looking for you. <laughs> Who are you talking about? Remember, of course, of Umali Kingdom. Uh, Have you suddenly forgotten him? Oh, uh, mother, you know I don't like Namdi. Why? You are supposed to be his betrothed. Thank God I wasn't. Because if I had been, you people would have regretted ever doing that. For God's sake, mother, I hate that guy. I mean, for no reason should I fall in love with him. I don't even like him. Why? Namdi is handsome. He's cute. He's tall. He's Oh, cute. mother! He's so proud of himself. The royal blood rejuvenates his egoism in the sense that he hates the less privileged and flaunts his shoulders. Mm -hmm. Mother, I don't like such a man. I want a man who is meek and humble, not a snob. My princess, such a man is rare in the royal families, you know. Must I marry from a royal family? Because we are inclined to it. <sighs> mother, no. Look, mother. Mother, I will marry a man my heart desires. I can't be compared to marry a man my heart forbids. Well, no one is forcing you, mind you. I'm only speaking my mind. Okay. Don't worry. Show me. Let's have a drink, shall we? Come on, my angel. <laughs> Don't worry. No matter the levels for me, things must happen. She's the princess, but as for me, I'll be first lady. This is my world. Everybody has to shut up, shut up in this kingdom. What I want, I will get, get, get. Like father, like daughter, they must have their way. Who no no go no? This is royal first class. How are you? I'm good. You're looking good. I know. <laughs> <laughs> ah, hola, ma. Hmm. I never knew Princess Ujo was such a lovely dancer. Hmm. In fact, her performance the other day was tremendous, I must confess. Enough. Enough, Chinine. I have warned you several. Never to bring up topics that concern Ujumwa whenever you're with me. Goodness, I'd rather you tell me what people out there are talking about me. Rather than have you spoil my day with Ujumwa's performance. What is your problem? Listen, in case you keep forgetting, I, I am Olama, the daughter of Onowichi, of Onwife Kingdom. And the Juma, she's just a princess, as you people choose to call her. So my darling, you see the two don't even look alike. But she's your cousin. And so, what has that got to do with me? She can go to hell and burn to ashes for all I care. about her that makes her so special. What? She has mates. Look here, darling. Look here. I have mates. 
She has an official car. I have that too. So what is it that makes you people look upon her like she's a goddess? What is it she has that I don't have? What? She's the princess. You are just the daughter of Onowu. Can't you see the golden difference? I swear to God, if you were not my best friend, I would have thrown you out of my father's house this minute. How dare you insult me? But you demanded to know the difference, and I've just demystified. Oh, shut up! Anyway, that's not why I came. Hola, Mama, my sister. Can you believe that Ifedi came to my house yesterday with his king's men? Ifedi the hunter? Yes, the wretched hunter. Guess what he came to do? What? To ask my hand in marriage. No! <laughs> Are you serious? That's what I'm telling you. Oh my, <laughs> oh my goodness. What? Wait, 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 Chine. Wait. Are you telling me that <coughs> it fed that wretched hunter that cannot even afford to feed himself? He had the effrontery. Come ask for your hand in marriage? Seriously? That's exactly what I'm telling you. <laughs> oh no, 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 that's a big insult, I swear to God. Some people, some people get crazy and they don't even know it. Come in. Poor people, they can never cut their cord according to their size. Anyway, as for me here, Olama. I would never, ever settle for anybody that is not in my class. For what? Why? I can't even manage. God it's forbid. Just, is that a stupidity? I mean, what on earth would make me fall in love with such a man? Nonsense. <laughs> on the other hand, I think you need to be a child. So you can't put out the marriage. <laughs> I bet you need to go and pray. <laughs> You're losing your thoughts. Oh, go for a beat. Go for my dance. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. I mean what I am saying. I am going to be the first Igwe that is going to give free education to my people. That's nice. See, look at that building. By the end of this year, we are going to finish the building. And during the opening ceremony, yeah. I am going to invite the president, at least 10 governors, yeah. the members of Senate. Yeah. Your Highness, Your Highness, Your Highness, Your Highness, Your Highness yes. is on the line. Princess, yeah. let me have the floor. Speak with him. Hello. Oh, the gods are at work. Your mother and your sister are right here with me. Oh, that was just to appreciate you for the wonderful thing you did. The car is so nice. Yeah, we are truly grateful. May the gods of our land continue to protect you and your brother over there. <laughs> yeah, so uh, how is it over there? Forbid. God forbid. May the gods forbid. You mean hovering all over the city with bad friends? Oh my god. No, not my own son. God. No. 
Wait, 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 wait. Is Ikena there with you? I'll do exactly that. Your Highness, what is it? Your Highness, what happened to him? Osama just told me that Ikena has abandoned his studies. Oh my God. Thereby ruining all the streets of Oxford Ikena. with bad friends. Why, why is Ikena this stubborn? He fails to understand the fact that he's not in his father's land. What if he dies there? God forbid he will not die. How can you say a thing like that about your brother? Oh my God, he can. Sometimes, sometimes I feel like blaming the gods for giving me such a song. A bad song that brings reproach to his father. No. Told me you were going out. <clears throat> Why is your countenance like this? Is anything the matter? Honestly, Father. I don't like the way I'm being looked upon in this village. Ujumwa carries herself with so much esteem and pride because the people regard her as the princess. But he, he know that is not true. Okay? That is not true. You you have everything and you even you possess even more than whatever she possesses that makes her a princess. And I've gone out of my way to ensure that you have mates and uh, all the paraphernalia, you know, something that goes with it. Daddy, she is still the princess. And having all I have in my possession still doesn't bring me up to her limits. You know what, Daddy? It's all your fault. If you had been the ego of this kingdom, Juma would be under my limit by now. Well, <clears throat> see that. This is maybe I have to let you know something. You see, I have taken my time to explain to you how he came to the throne. His late father, my stepbrother, was chosen by the gods to be the way of the kingdom. But if he dies today, you can be the ego, right? <laughs> That's if he doesn't have a son. Well, he has two. Uzonna and Ikenna, your cousins. So you're saying it's impossible for you to be the equal of this kingdom? That's what you're saying, Daddy? Sweetheart, come, come. I'm not saying that, okay? Um. Daddy, you have to do something. Do whatever it takes for you to be the equal of this kingdom so I can be the princess. I want to be a princess and I must achieve it. By all means necessary, Daddy, I will. By all means necessary, Daddy. You want to be a princess? Okay. Um, where's my brother? Ugo! Ugo!
finally hey what goes what goes up must come down the fresh shall be the last and the last all oh, the wicked ones yeah there's a number Ifegbi, Ifegbi, what what is it? What is wrong? Why are you sad? Obina, for God's sake, Obina, why has the gods decided to turn their backs on us? Irrespective of the efforts we have put in to have a better living. I toil under the scorching sun every day. You have spent quite a number of years in our maternal home, struggling to survive. He had nothing to show for it. I feel the spirit, I don't know. I feel the spirit. If you will, please, I am begging you, don't be. Listen, sometimes life is full of ups and downs. And the only way you can survive is with dodge perseverance. Febu, our destiny can be delayed, but it can never be destroyed. I believe there's a reason why the gods has allowed us into this family. Please, my brother, cheer up. Right for my childhood. I have been deceived by this your words of a better tomorrow, Obina. For God's sakes, when will this tomorrow be? Look at us. Just, just, just look at us. It is so obvious that we are the poorest family in this village. You are supposed to be in the high institution. But there is no money to sponsor that. Just imagine, imagine the, 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 the supper we just had. No meat, no fish. Tasteless. Is that what you call an interim do? Listen. You don't have to think about tomorrow. Let tomorrow decide for itself. All you need to do now is work hard. Work hard and let your efforts Perfect your future. If able the fact that we're poor today does not mean we will continue being poor. I want you to be strong. Okay? Listen. Let me let me help you. Of animal, place, or thing. <laughs> Chidi, now. What's your problem? Why are you bringing all this into the present? See that finished with since that you know I've dumped him and you're asking me about him. What do you want to hear? Hola, ma. You. <laughs> oh, wow. so. Good day. Good day. Good day, one. Hi. Is Mazibe's son. You know Mazibe now? The poor Pamwain Tapa? Mm -hmm. They said he grew up in his maternal home. And so? What has that got to do with me? Can't you see? He's very handsome. 
and he's loving and intelligent, I hear. He's the talk of every girl in this town. Everybody wants him for a lover. <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> I say you will kill me today. Every girl wants this one that is looking homeless for a lover. Mm -hmm. How? What can he offer? Oh please, that's just the height of crimes. Well, well, it's true he's got nothing to offer, but like I said, he's loving, caring, charming, intelligent, all those other stuffs. Yeah. Uh-huh. Can some And so? <laughs> will you eat love? Go. As long as he's not in my class. You see that thing you see walking there is looking very homeless, eh? You can't come close to me. You can only impress and let the poor stinking girls in his level to drool over him. Not my kind. And what is your problem? Why are you just yanning off point today? What oh, for you? Please give me the number of your stylist. Oh, I need to go wait, change wait. my hair. Let me get it. Hurry, please. My son, Osonna, called me a few days ago just to inform me that our son, Ikenna, is about coming home. Iwe, that's good news. It's been a long time I saw him last and I'd love to see him again. Are you encouraging him to come back home? Iwe, there's, there's nothing wrong with him coming back home. He's our son after all. And there's nothing wrong with uh, him coming home to see his people after a long while. No. See, but he's still schooling over there. What do you think will happen to his studies if he comes back home? Iwe, Iwe, you worry a lot. Ikenna is a very mature boy. And I know him to be a boy that takes very sane decision. He would have worked out his schedule before planning the visit. This I know. But... But I still think it is stupid of him. No, no, no. He will let him take away. Let him come home. And that should be what I've been there. You don't drive a child away from your father's compound. No. You have a visitor in the palace. Tell them I am coming. If it says so. Hello. Hey. You must be the princess. I can see your, your maidens. No. I am Olama, daughter of Onowichi. The princess and I share equal rights. And she's no better than me. Oh. It's nice to meet you, Olama. What's your name? My name is Obinda. Yeah. That's a lovely name. 
Thank you. You're a student? Um, no, not yet. I learned you grew up in your Matana home. How did you know? Well, yes, I did. I, I grew up in my mother's village. Well, I could tell though. You look different from the men of our town. You're princely charming. Oh, thanks for the compliments. <laughs> I appreciate it. So I see you're headed somewhere and I wouldn't want to take much of your time. But uh, how do we say? Um, I am always free, but it's just that sometimes I help my father run some errand. Yes. Okay. I'll work something out. You can go. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. How do you see him? He's so cute and lovely. I've never seen such a lovely young man in our village before. Does he look like someone I can manage? Ah, uh, my princess. I think you can. You can manage him. Well, I'm starting to have this striking likeness for him. <laughs> but he's just too poor for my standard. He's too poor. Oh. My princess. But I think my princess can manage him if she wishes. <laughs> mm. Mm. You guys get in the car. I suggest you go back and survey that land properly before coming to bid the price to us. Well, Your Highness, uh, I've done that already before coming to you. Do you people know the number of hectares of land involved that you're pricing us, paying us? Or did they tell you before you came here that we are poor people? Don't you know that this is a land of prominent people? Don't you know that? That we should be talking about billions of naira, not millions. Excuse me, mister. Hey! Did I hear you just call me mister? Did I just hear you call me mister? Do you know why? Oh no, a witch! On the ground, a one of whom we the kingdom. And you call me mister? The mouthpiece of the people. My friend, learn to talk to me with some respect. Did you hear what I said? I'm sincerely sorry. Uh, oh no, witch. Oh no, witch. You better be. But, Your Highness, I'm only trying to enlighten us on the importance of our company coming to invest in this land. It will ensure development to this community. Two, it will create more employment to the youths of this community and vice versa. Say, young man, we don't need any explanation before we buy the knowledge. That is why we encourage foreign investors to come into our land and invest. See, our people cherish our land so well. See, we can't displease ourselves in order to please you. We cannot give away that land for our peanuts. But, Your Highness, uh, 
30 million is, is not too small. That's to you. It is <laughs> peanuts to us. It's 50 million or nothing. Well, Your Highness, I've heard you. You can see I'm only but a messenger. I will go and render account to the people that sent me. You will surely hear from me. Oh, that's fine. I will also uh, get back to my cabinet members and um, discuss with them. When next you will come, I will tell you exactly what we concluded. Thank you, Your Highness. You're welcome. I'll be on my leave. Good job. Our kingdom is on 
That's because you are lost in thoughts now. How are you? I'm fine. Tell me. What are you thinking? You're thinking of Olama again, Abi. Olama? No. I'm not. It's a lie. Tell me you're falling in love with her. In love? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm not in love with her. Come on. But that is a lie. You can't deny it. I can read it from your eyes. <laughs> okay, okay, tell me. Don't you think she's beautiful? Mm, Olama is such a beautiful girl. Everyone knows that. But her beauty is not skin deep. How do you mean? Olama is the most snobbish person I've ever seen. She's very, 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 very full of herself. She's a braggart and even the strangers in this kingdom think she's the princess from the way she flaunts her shoulders. I hate her. But don't you think such a derogatory remarks does not fit your fellow girl? Why don't you speak better of her? I'm sorry, brother. I'm sorry. I can't hide it from you. I just feel that you should know since you're her friend. She, she's not my friend. I just met her only once now. That, oh. that's all. I'm sorry. Your friend to be. Um, just be careful. You know she despises people lower of her social class. Mm. Okay. Yeah. I'll be careful. Yeah. So, tell me about that. Just. What? What? What is wrong with you? Are you? Are you okay? I'm okay. I'm okay. Huh? Eh? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, what? What do you want me to tell you about? What? What? What do you want me to tell you? Amazing. I can't believe you're the one saying this. After everything you said about never falling for a commoner below your status, how come this emotional feeling for this pauper? Hey, mind you, Opina is not a pauper. Mm hmm. No, granted, his family is poor. But my dear. There's a shared difference between a poor man and a papa. Okay. Sorry, you. But you still did not answer my question. Well, <laughs> I don't know how it happened. Hmm. I can't even pinpoint what it is exactly that got me attracted to him. Mm -hmm. But you have to acknowledge. Now this guy is princely charming. He can easily sway a girl off her feet. Not with that sexy, sexy body. And his very charming voice. <laughs> <laughs> you see? But the other day I was telling you about him, you were like, oh, shut up, forget uh -huh. what I said. I know what I say, I say a lot of shit, all right. But you know what? What we should concern ourselves with right now is how to get him for me. Mm -hmm. I want him. You do? Yes. To myself. I'm sure somewhere some bush girl is having a secret admiration or crush on him. Of course. So, you think? Well, you've got everything it takes to keep him to yourself. You know what a guy of his financial class needs. You know now. All you need to do is shower him with lots of it and he would forever remain loyal to you. Hmm. You think so? <laughs> Why not? Just a try I would attest to that. It's simple now. As easy as A, B, C. <laughs> <laughs> Very simple. Okay, okay we are so on. Do you want to drink to that? Oh, definitely. You go, Chris. Um, Iwe. No. Now that the uh, people have at 
agreed to pay the 50 million we asked them to pay. Yes. How much money are we going to remove for ourselves before presenting the rest to the people? Oh no. Yes, he will. Are you insinuating we keep some of the money to ourselves? Igwe, I, I, I was on mark. We're not kids. Oh, wait a minute. Were you planning on presenting the whole money to those scruffy, haggard elders of yours? Baron Lona, Baron Lona. Things are not done that way. As the pipers that dictate the tune, we should be able to keep a chunk of the money. After all, it is said that to move up in Egypt, only a match a ball or a chill, no man. Not in this. Not in this. I cannot cheat on my people. May the gods forbid. I can only take the rightful one given to me by our people. <laughs> Are you trying to tell me that you want to give the whole 50 million to the people? Exactly. Since he has refused to pay the piper, the piper will pay itself with a loss. I shall wait until the king now returns. Yes. Uh, I'm so sorry to have kept you waiting. Uh, it's okay. I'm just glad you finally came. Um, so tell me, um, why did you decide we meet here? Because I have something very important to discuss with you. Oh, really? Oh, that's that's wonderful. Oh, thank you very much. Are you fools still standing there doing looking at me? You need me to tell you before you get out? Can you imagine? But Olama, you didn't have to chase them away. I mean, that's a very unpleasant way to talk to people. They're not your animals. They're not animals, I mean, they're your mates. Well to me they are animals. 
and animals are subject to humans. That's why I can talk to them however I please. Oh no, no. I completely disagree with you. Listen, every human being has his or her own respect in accordance. Okay? I mean, the fact that they're your maidens does not mean you should treat them the way you like. They're human beings, just show some respect, that's all. I mean, that's my visual perception. And you will keep that visual perception to yourself. They are my mates. I know how to treat them. You're not gonna teach me how to treat my mates now, are you? <laughs> you know what, I'm sorry. Come here, I'm very sorry. I don't um, want those nitwits to make me quarrel with you. I came here to have a good time with you, huh? So let's not quarrel. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. It's just that um, I'm not comfortable with you treating people like this. I mean, I believe people should be treated with equal rights no matter their background. It's very important. Equal rights? <laughs> Honey, I'm sorry. That is not obtainable. There's nothing like equal rights in a world where some people are born wretched and some other people, like me, are born with a silver spoon. The two are not the same and cannot share equal rights. <laughs> You're funny. Yeah. Don't worry. Yeah. Okay. So, anything I should know? That is your fault. It's all your fault. Why should I blame him anyways? If you had been in the position where he is now, and you have the power to decide whether to keep some for yourself or to give the whole of it out, this wouldn't even be happening in the first place. Every day I watch you go through a series of headache with matters concerning this kingdom. And what do you get in return? You are rewarded with lots of humiliation and foul mockery. What is the profit you want? So my daughter, what do you want me to do? What do you do? You're asking me what you will do, Daddy. Isn't it obvious what is happening here? The Igwe is doing this on purpose. He's doing this to frustrate you, to impoverish you, to make you a nobody in his kingdom. And you sit there and ask me what to do? Okay, here's what we do. For starters, you will sit here and keep complaining. I think I now know what to do. You think? You're still thinking? See, this is, the, this is the problem with you. Very typical of you. Every day you think you know what to do and gradually we're watching things going from bad to worse. In fact, I'm not thinking of what to do. I know what to do. Better for you. And whatever it is you're thinking or knowing that you should do, let it be fast. I want us to know that every decision that will be taken here this afternoon will be binding. Mm. Yes, it yes. Is. yes, yes, yes. Mm. Have I made myself clear? Yes, you will. Yes, you will. So we don't ask anybody not to come. Well, Have I spoken our minds? He will. No, I know that. Eyes of the gods. Are we safe this afternoon? Igwe, a toll does not run in vain in the afternoon. I know. I have come to give you a message of caution. Igwe, the wind of an impending doom is blowing, and only the wise ones. Escape from it. Eyes of the gods. What do we do? 
wise world seeks solution where the fools has failed. This high time you applied your wisdom, Igwe. Igwe, a man is easily trapped with what he loves most. Igwe, beware. Beware, Igwe. I shall take my leave now. He brought. Huh? He goes and saved the chief peace of this kingdom. What has he done to protect the lives of the subjects of this kingdom? That is the problem. Imagine. Now, imagine the kind of incomprehensible message he brought. Who would deduce from what he specifically means? Nobody. You could forget about him. Uh, well, Igwe, what I comprehend from what Njoku said that there's an impending doom. That's what I understand from what he said. Impending doom in your kingdom or in your own house. In your own house, not my own house. What are you talking about? We're talking about this man coming here bringing an incomprehensible message and you're talking, talking, talking nonsense. Oh no, it's okay. Is impending doom in your house? It's your own house. It's no, okay. no, 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 no. It's okay. Oh, what is it? your voice? It's your Do you want to fight me? Don't raise your no, voice. It's okay. okay. Please. He will have said it's okay. Please. We don't have to fight over this. Okay. You are here to tell me where you got this alligator because it is quite different from the one I <laughs> will normally eat in the past. You all know. You should always know that everything you get in the past should be different. Okay. <laughs> Your Highness, you have a message from Mazibe. Let him in. Oh. I will certainly know where this came from. Somehow. Oh no. You are in the position to know. <laughs> so, my father asked me to deliver this palm wine to you, Your Majesty. And who is your father? Um, Mazi Ibe, the palm wine tapper. Wait. wait, wait. Are you telling me you are Mazi Ibe's son? Yes, Your Majesty. Are you trying to tell me that Mazibe has a son that has been at this? Yes, sir. No, no, no. This is wickedness. You wait. This is wickedness. You mean Mazibe has a son like this and he kept him away from us? Um, no, it, it is not like that. It's just that I did not grow up here. I grew up in my maternal home. Oh, I come on, sir. No wonder. You're welcome, my son. You're welcome, my son. Thank you. Mm. Uh. Your Majesty. Father. I'm home. Uncle. Mm. Father, I want to go to my maternal home. The morning star. My princess. You are free to go to your maternal home. Send me well today. Thank you, Father. Uh -huh. um, uh, show him who to give the drink. So, so, 
he be as he be so like this. Well, um, I called you to alert you of uh, you can ask you my So you all will have to begin to warm up. You know, because as soon as he returns, things will begin to happen. And as your childhood friend, you will know what to do. So get ready. Uh, so, Ikena is coming back? Of course. Hey! Oh no! What's up, giddy giddy? What's up, no ketchup? Who will you find in the world? I am going to the door. What are you doing? I'm going to say, 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 I'm going to don't remind me of uh, <laughs> before I jump out of my school. <laughs> oh no, oh no, yeah. oh, no uh, you have spoken well. But that is at all. If he can now still remember us, so, uh, if he has not overgrown us all. Not the Ikenna, you know. Unima, we have gone too far with Ikenna for him to disdain on us. He can't do that. Only oh, move, man. Then let me tell you something. These things are expected. Even if it happens, we know how to handle it. I mean, it's obvious that he might uh, show some signs of uh, being uh, snobbish. Yeah, you know, but leave that to me. I will bring him back to his senses. Hey! Oh, no, Maria! Oh, no! find my house. <laughs> Are you surprised? Yes, because I didn't dream of the princess coming to, to visit me today. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry for the nightmare. Just that I love taking people by surprise. Uh, no, no. It, it's not a nightmare. It's, it's, rather, it's rather a blessing. I mean, uh, for a princess of Umuife Kingdom to come visit me in my house. I'm highly honored. Um, please, can I, can I get you a seat? Don't worry, don't bother yourself. Um, please, can we go for a walk? A walk? With me? Yes. Yes. Uh, are you busy? Um, no, I was actually on my way to the farm, but I could go change into something better and I'll be with you. Oh, please, just not Okay. So, uh, how do you see our village? I like it. <laughs> I actually like the serenity of the environment is is full of warmth yeah that's my land i love my land and i love my people <laughs> my people are wonderful people they're very cordial and generous haven't you noticed it yes i have <laughs> just like my mother's people mm. they're so caring they're very very understanding I'm happy to be home. Uh, 
are you are you a student? I'm not. My my parents cannot afford to send me to school. something else. Princess, aren't we staying too long? I mean, your parents might be looking for you now. And I, I have to go distribute some palm wine. Yeah, for my father. You're right. It's really nice spending a happy moment with you. It's my pleasure. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay, let's go. After you. <laughs> Could he be the young man I saw at the palace yesterday? Uh, what does he look like? Mm, Light-skinned, gentle-looking young man like that. That's him. That's him, father. So, how do you see him? What do you think? Well, he's okay. It's just that I'm not too comfortable with his uh, financial status. You know. I know. But I may have fallen in love with him. And I can't tell why. But I want him all to myself, Father. Yeah. Before some village girl snatches him away from me. I really love him. Well, um, it's okay. It's all right. But uh, you don't. You know that uh, ordinarily I would not. Uh, allow you to settle with a man like that, you know. But since you say you're in love with him, I give my blessing. It's okay. Uh, my only daughter, all I have, your happiness is paramount. <laughs> Thank you so much, Daddy. I am going to send a royal order out to his father to stop him from going to the palace. The palace? Yeah, yesterday I noticed the way the princess was keeping at him lustfully, you know? I mean... Father, would you want again? Oh, not to bother yourself, come on. Don't oh, worry, I'll handle it. I'll handle it. I'll make sure anything that will get him to the palace is stopped. Everything that will get him to the palace is redirected to this place. So you can have him all to yourself. Spend more time with him. But don't you trust your father anymore? I like that. Don't you trust me, baby? I trust you, Daddy. Thank you so much. Thank anything you. for you, okay? No. An implausible order. Uh, I can't see any reason why you're retreated from the palace. I mean, you've not done anything wrong. I, I I don't understand. Sometimes I just I just think the the ego is not comfortable with my constant visit to the palace. I just 
I feel something is wrong somewhere. Uh, no, Obina. You know what I think? I think Olama and her father have something to do with this. How do you mean? You see, Uno might have noticed some moves. Now your restriction from the palace will bridge the gulf between you and the daughter. And by that means, the princess will indirectly be disfavored as you take the Panwai to his house every day. Oh yes! You have a point there. You think so? Yes, I do. If Ebu is right, brother, that is exactly the plan. You know that man no know He is wiser than the serpent. Uh, he is so fond of his daughter and can do anything to satisfy his selfish desire. You, you call that a selfish desire? Yes, brother. <laughs> I, I don't think it's a selfish desire. Any rational woman in her shoes, we do say, even you, ma. <laughs> it's strange. I, I, I don't understand. It's crazy. It's strange. Why did you decide to abandon your studies in the middle of the semester just to visit home? Nothing. Yeah, nothing. I, I just wanted to come home. You know, smart people, see everyone, know how everyone's doing. Got a problem with that? Well, uh, nothing is wrong about that. But remember, right things done at the wrong time is expressly wrong. Yes, I can't see any tangible reason behind you abandoning your studies just to visit home. Well, I missed you. Yeah, I missed you, old man. I miss, I miss mom. I miss my sister. I missed everyone. You know, my village, my, my people, my blood. I missed everyone, Dad. That's all. I decided to come back home. You know, relate with my folks again, Dad. You know, that's all. But we always call you people to inform you everything about home. You would have been receiving the calls if not that you decided to engage yourself with. Those stupid idiots you call your friends who never allowed you to stay at a place. Dad! Can you spare me all this? Look, I said it before I came home to spend some quality time with my people. Iken, do you really know the meaning of your name? I do not think you know. Ikenna means the strength of his father. Are you actually portraying the meaning of this name Ikenna? Okay. Now that you have seen that we are all healthy and hearty, when are you planning to go back? Time and condition will tell. I'm a busy man. Got an appointment. Says you 
will not leave. Let him slip before the cockerel. Let him slip before the cockerel. <laughs> no, I, no, I greet you. I, I greet you too. <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh, <laughs> Once again, you're welcome, you're welcome, you're welcome. Uncle, these dudes, these dudes are messing with me. I'm telling you, can you believe my old man was asking me silly questions last night? Like, what did I come home to do? Like, why should I come home? What is that? What, what, do, you, what do you expect from an old man like him? What does he know? Eh? Doesn't he know that a young, fresh, vigorous blood like you needs freedom? No, no, I don't, need, I don't need no, no freaking nigga trying to cage me because I'm too fly to the cage. Hey, that's my nigga! <laughs> this is my nigga! Hey! Nigga! Hey! Oh, okay, no. oh, slow down. You know you're getting old, old man. <laughs> I missed you. I missed you. I missed you. Oh, I missed you. I missed you. I missed you. I always loved you. Oh. Now we're going back home. Oh, yeah, you see? You see? Not south, it's not west. Always on my own. You're welcome to my home. Come, let us go inside our house. Fresh pump wine. Where you Abaraka? My nigga. They don't know you. They don't know you like nigga, man. But I know you, old man. Jesus. Nigga, nigga, nigga. Boss is all good. Princess. Hi. You you didn't come with your mate? No, I feel an easy going out with them. But but why? They are your pride. Just that my parents won't sit down that way. You know, I hate being treated like a goddess or whatever. I just want to be myself and live like a common being. <laughs> no, my princess, you're not common. You're royalty. I, I mean you cannot deny your destiny. I know, but I just want to feel like every other woman being granted the freedom of movement and not being followed around by guards or maids. Just like the other day, I spent a little moment with you. When I got home, I was scolded by my parents for arriving late. Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. Oh, Please, on. I'm sorry. Come on, come, come on. Me. That's nothing. You know, I derive joy spending time with the one I love. I'm sorry for hiding away my feelings from you all this while. But I love you. My princess, you cannot love me. I, I am a nobody. I, I have nothing to offer. My father is just a poor palm I care not about what you can offer me. All I care about is your heart. Just say you love me. But, but, but you, you can't love me. I'm not in the I same class care. with you. I'm not in the same class with you. I don't princess. care. I don't care. Just, just say you love me. Please. This 
you're going to jack that to not die. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Versace. 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 You cannot. Yeah. I am glad you're home. I thought you would have forgotten all about us and mix up with white boys and girls over there. Like good number of our youthful traveler did. Those motherfuckers are fools. You know, I never forgot the old saying. East or west, home is the best. Bad guy! What the nigga? I'm telling you, I thought about you dogs, man. I thought about my niggas, my dogs. And I said to myself, hey, little G, dust your ass up. Come back to Nigeria, come see your dog. <coughs> that, that is very good of you, man. That's very good of you. <laughs> mm. Unlike your elder brother who's on now. Ever since he traveled, he never talks about home. Don't mind that one. I believe by now he must have forgotten us, right? That dude's a motherfucker. Believe me. Just a motherfucker. You know, can you believe it was keeping tabs on me back in the UK? What? I'm telling you, he was spying on me, like watching every move I made, and then reporting back to my folks saying, now these motherfuckers right here, they kept on. I kept on calling me. You know, they were calling me, they were calling me, calling me, calling me. Every, every, every single minute, they were calling me. The, the calls were coming unbearable. You know, one morning I woke up. You know what I did? Nah. I changed my life. I changed my life! I changed my life! I changed my life! I changed my life! No wonder your father called you his friend. I, I I believe you like mad. I believe you die, my guy. I believe you. <laughs> well, you know, back in the UK, we don't we don't put it that way. You yeah. say my nigga, my nigga, <laughs> hang on my dog, oh, my <laughs> nigga, my dog. Don't mind me, my nigga. Champion. Is it play dog? Champion. 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 Uh, yes, all he does now to move from one house to the other impregnate his small small girls. <laughs> yes, that's his life. See, 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 if you hear me, I will, I will chop your nose to be for that. It's okay, it's okay. 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 I want to know what you're thinking. I'm going to get out of the world. 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 I'm going to get out of Are you sure what you told me right now is the truth? I'm sure you don't know me as a gossip. I saw them with my own two eyes. I didn't tell you someone said, but said I saw. Uju, Uju, you again? Uju again? You be looking for my trouble every time. She you have seen now. This bastard knows I hate her. I hate her with so much passion. Why would she have some brains and stay away from anything that has to do with all Amma? Why? Is she okay? Because of this same bastard, I murdered my ex-boyfriend in our university days. Because the foolish boy now dumped me out. I was pursuing Ujua. Now Ujua again. She have seen Ujua now. You did that? And I, 
will do worse if she ever crosses my path again. It's just a pity. It's a pity I don't know who the victim will be this time. I don't know. <laughs> but if I find out who, if I find out anything you've said now, if I find I find out. Okay. No problem. There's no problem at all. Ah. I'll reserve my comments. Well, it's of no use expressing doubts about this. Because I just told you the truth. Well, that truth of yours, I still have to find out. Okay. okay. told me because I have something very important to ask you what could that be Obina um. is it true that you and Ajuma have something going no I don't have anything to do with the princess absolutely nothing I mean that is not to say you haven't met her before. Um, I only met her once, and that was actually the day I was going to the farm. So I ran into her, and we exchanged pleasantries and went our separate ways. That's all. And ever since, you've not met her again. No. That's not necessary. I mean, I don't have anything in common with her. Yes. Well, let me believe you. I choose to believe you. Because if for any reason I find out you actually have something going with her, I won't take it lightly. You know why? Drew and I are the worst of enemies. For life, we are enemies. So I will hate to hear that you have whatsoever going on with her. You hear me? about that. Thank goodness you're here. Let's go inside. I've been bored all day. My father went for their cabinet meeting and we really need good company right now. Um, Oloma, I'm, I'm really sorry to disappoint you. 
I actually have an errand I need to run for my father. And I cannot compromise that for anything. An errand? An errand when you have two younger ones that are doing what at the moment? Um, if Ibu and Ma are actually busy, you know, helping my father tap some palm wine. You know my father is a palm wine tapper. Right. Yes. Right. Um, but not to worry, I'll come around and pay you a visit some other time. Yeah. I promise. Never lives in daylight without a cause. Oh no, what is it you seek of Ishoku? <clears throat> Adaka the Great One, I want Ichoku to help me achieve my dreams. What you seek is not an easy task. But in Joko, the God of Thunder will grant your heart's desire. If, only if, you abide to its instructions. Ataka, I am willing to abide by its instructions. Taking the throne from Igwe Obi is not an easy task. It's not easily achievable. <laughs> you know he has two sons. If he join his ancestors today, the others take over. <laughs> but no matter how the Iroko tree grows, it never touches the sky. Manoko tree never as grows its planter. But you will help you achieve your heart desire. <laughs> Adaka. Hmm? Adaka. Hmm. The eyes of the spirits. The only living being who travels to and fro in the land of the spirits and returns with extraordinary power. I Mother, I overheard Father rebuking Ike another part. What did he do this time? My dear princess, I really don't know what is wrong with that your brother. Ever since he came back, he's been giving your father one series of headache or the other. It's either he brings in girls to the palace, or he comes home with those useless friends of his that your father forbids. You see? You see, that's why I hate him. He's so stubborn and I hate him for that. No, you don't speak of your brother that way. Mother, I can't hide it. I wish he was never my brother. 
Seriously, his character disgusts me. And I'm totally ashamed. It's okay, princess. It's okay. You don't hate your brother. He's a blood brother, you know. Your biological brother. Mother, still I can't change it. I can't. <sighs> if he doesn't do anything about it. I'm ready now. Can we can we go? You're ready? Yes, I'm ready. You're ready dressed in this cozy outfit. What's wrong with it? Is it not clean? <gasps> Are you seriously asking me what's wrong with it? Like you don't know what's wrong with it? Everything is wrong with it. Look at you. Abina, everybody knows that you are poor. Everything about you and your family screams poverty. Starting from where you live and all. Can you help yourself a little by hiding it? Hey, you can actually save money once in a while and buy some new clothes. Come on. Um, I, I am sorry. Um, just that the money is what I don't have. I'm actually managing myself. Go out with me dressed like this. Ah, what kind of embarrassment is this? To my kind of personality. Oh, please. This is so dirty. Okay, I'll, I'll just go back maybe next time. You will walk? Where are you going? I am going back to my house. You don't want me to go out with you because poverty is written all over my face. But there's no problem. Please, I want to be left alone now. My friend, come back here. Obina! Obina! Obina, come back here! Oh! Obina! How has it been with you over there, my son, Ozona? Well, we're okay, we're okay. Uh, um, the only problem we are having here is your brother Iken. Uh, uh, he never, he has never allowed us to breathe in here ever since he came back from my bro. He just said he came to see us. Uh, that was all. I thought you wanted, you wanted to say any other thing. Anyway, I cannot be afraid of my own son. Yes, 
I consider that as uh, an act of youthful exuberance. Yes, that's all. Mm, it's okay, I've heard you, son. I've heard you, I've heard you, no problem. Just take care of yourself. It's okay, they'll, they'll hear that. Take care of yourself, bye bye. What a surprise, you didn't tell me you were coming. <laughs> um, please, let me get a, a seat for um, you. Don't worry, don't worry. I'm going on a feast with my parents, so I decided to bring this for you before I go. Hey! My princess, you bought clothes for me. No. I never bought any clothes for you. Just I went shopping with my parents last night, so I saw this. Knowing it will look good on you, I decided to pick it for you. Thank you. Thank you. I don't, I don't know. Hey, stop! For what? <laughs> Stay. Thank you very much. I don't know how to thank you. <laughs> That's why. Um, I'll be taking my leave now. Would you mind joining us? Joining you? Um... Uh -huh. Okay, fine. I know you definitely say no, but okay, <laughs> you take care of you, okay? Okay. Bye. Bye bye. Okay. Who was that? That was the princess. What? She came visiting. What? See? She bought me clothes. <laughs> what? Wait. You mean the princess bought all this for you? I told you this princess is a genius. She's far better than Olama. Forget about that Olama for and go after her. She loves you. Yes. She loves you. But, but how can I forget about Olama? I met Olama first now. Eh? I met Olama first. Eh? It's not going to be easy like that. Eh? So so what about the princess? I like the princess. She's very kind. Can you imagine she bought me clothes? Huh? So? What's it feel? She's a princess. How do like we don't match ourselves? I'm not in the same class with her. That's my problem. But she loves you. Yes, she does. Go after her. You think so? Yes! She loves you. <laughs> See, 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 
you know? Let me see. Why, why, why are you looking at it now? Why you, 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 you. He cannot. He cannot. He The two sons of his father. Abu. Oni. Wana haji. He The two sons of his father. I salute you. I know what I greet you. We got you. We know what I greet you. How are you? <laughs> How many times have I warned you against seeing you and this boy? How many times? And you, young man, I thought I forbid you from this palace. Yes, you will indeed, but. Uh, uh, yeah, that I asked him to come. This dude right here has been my childhood buddy, my childhood dog, you know? I don't see why you should ask him not to associate with me. How dare you challenge my authority? How dare you? Uh, 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 Igwe, I don't understand. What, what is it? What is it? How dare you? I told this boy that I don't want to see him and this criminal because of his evil character. I told my son to quit every relationship with this young man who is known in this community for nothing but selling of hard drugs and other criminal acts. See, that is the boy my son chose as a friend. Oh, come on, old man. You know it's not true. This, this dude right here, this dark, is a good, good dude, man. Good dude. You don't do that. You're accusing him wrongly, Dad. What? You said I am accusing him? Yes, you are accusing this dude here wrongly. Did I hear you say I am accusing him? I just him? told you, old man. You are accusing my dog wrongly. There's nothing wrong with this dude right here. Guys! Come, the police. Come and throw away this criminal here. Hey. Now. Move. 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 Dad. That was all of embarrassment, is this? What sort of embarrassment is this? Don't I have the right to do whatever I wish in this crib, huh? You don't have any right. I am your father. You dare not challenge my authority. Enough! Can you imagine that? Can you imagine that? Allow me to handle You know, we get along. Okay? Just leave it. You better do that, since you are the one that he listens to. Mm. Mm. Allow no, no. Yes, allow me. Allow me to. Better do something before I strangle this idiot with my bare hands. Don't worry. Okay, I will. I will. I will. He has forgotten who I am. Uh, it is okay. It's okay. Huh? Uh, you tell him, okay? You see me in my house. Okay? We have to. I have to stay. Huh? I think Obina is indirectly avoiding me these days. He finds every excuse possible to avoid spending time with me. I think it's because he's been seeing Ujunga. And like the witch that she is, she has stolen his heart. You must understand that there's a stiff competition going on between you and the princess now. Yama, you this girl. How many times have I warned you that whenever you're with me, she's not a princess? Do I need to break your head and stitch it right back before you realize that? Mm -hmm. What's your problem? Sorry, but I still want you to believe what I've just told you. She's doing everything within her powers to keep him all to herself. 
and you know she's got pragmatic and strategic ways of getting whatever she desires. How do you mean? She must have stolen his heart with gifts and goodies. And you know that any man of Obina's class would easily succumb to that. Oh! Oh! Now I get it. You're right! You're so right! That's about the only strategy she would have used to penetrate him deep. Because if Uju and I are to go by physical and natural endowments, oh come on, what are we talking? I'm better than her. A million times better. So you know she's not better than me. Is she better than me? <laughs> we are big head. What? Is she? What has she got? That's it. <laughs> Just play all your games and get your man back. And poison his heart against that princess. Sorry, Uju. Because that's what I do. Tell me I don't, I don't, I don't have the right to do whatever I wish. For Christ's sake, it's my life. Oh, forget about it, Zekenad. That Igwe is an old man. What does he know? He doesn't know young men ought to be allowed to do whatever they want to do. Do you know? Forget about him. Just do whatever you want to do, okay? Oh, Archive out. Oh, he do whatever you want to do. I'm telling you that that old man, he. He's oppressing me. Oh. Yeah, sometimes I just, I just wish he was a little kid so I can just tie him up and just, you know, just, 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 just. And, and, and when I'm done, I'm gonna castrate him. <laughs> I'm telling you, he just, he just drives me crazy. He just, just drives me crazy. He's an old man. He's an old man. He doesn't know what time it is. <laughs> I need a drag. Well, I, need, I need a drag. You know. <laughs> I need a drag, I need a drag. I need a drag, uncle. I need a drag. Oh, I hope you don't mind. Uh, this is a house for niggas. Do you think you want to drink? Smoke anything you want to smoke. <laughs> That's my nigga! No, I love you, I love you, man. No. I keep, I keep telling these people, mm. these old men, mm. they think they know you. Mm. But they don't know you. They don't know me. They don't know you. I know you like the back of my palm. Mm. You're a bloody ass nigga, man. They don't know me. Hang on. Mm. Hang on. Yeah. Mm. Nigga. Yeah. Nigga. <laughs> My dog. Mm. Mm.
Those people who are loyal and humble to your authority, like they will not like you. Uh, uh, furthermore, you see those guards, those your father's guards. Yeah. Those just those idiots just left here now. You have to get rid of all of them. You cannot trust any one of them. And they bring in the niggas. Hey, my blood, you know. Uh, my blood. Yeah. Azuna. Azuna. Oh, yeah, man. Those ones are your childhood friends. They will watch your back. Those ones will watch your back. As niggas. <laughs> no, no. You got brains, man. You got brains. Yeah, that's a nigga. That's a nigga. You know what? You're right. You're right now. I'm working towards it. And soon, everyone in this village is going to know that the days of my father, that old man, those days are gone. This is my time now. Trust me. I'm gonna make them feel the heat. <laughs> yeah. As for the gods, yes. I'll take care of it. I say, Mika. Know this. Uh. You're a badass, man. <laughs> no, you you're a badass. <laughs> you feel me? You feel a proper man. You're a badass. <laughs> Hey, 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 wow. <laughs> nigga, I like this. Oh, nigga. Hey, nigga. This, okay, this one is you, man. Do I do? Nigga. <laughs> nigga, this one is better than the other one. Did I finish it? Nah, no, give me my stuff. <laughs> 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 
I said for you earlier, your mate said you were still sleeping. You were not all. Mother, my heart is troubled. I am no longer comfortable with the situation of things in this kingdom. Imagine what Mazion no and Ikena are trying to turn this kingdom into. Lots of people have been tormented on a daily basis. Good number of people have been denied of their properties, land and natural inheritance. What do we call that? My dear, Omo has finally had his way over Ikena. Ikena is just too young to rule this kingdom. He's only heading towards his direction. Breaking all the precedents of your father's rule in this kingdom. Mother, Ikena is so heartless and I hate him for that. Well, I'm just worried about Ozonna. I'm just concerned about his condition over there. It was because of his absence during your father's funeral that they had to crown Ikena the Yugwe. Just because the government was pressurizing them to provide one for them. And they have to give it to the next available person. Mother, I don't believe those stories. I don't believe them at all. Mazio no one Ikena, they knew what they did. But my only happiness is that one day, Ozona must surely come back. And let me see how Ikena would not leave that seat. I pray so, my daughter. Princess, listen, it was a big shock when I heard about your father. And I've been looking for an opportunity to come see you. But I'm so afraid to come to your house. Yeah. But listen, I, I know you have every right to hate me. I feel so guilty. Please forgive me. I'm so sorry about your father. Okay. It's not your fault. I understand how you feel. Okay. I want you to read my lips. I am not angry with you. Rather, I should apologize on behalf of my family for punishing your innocent father. I just pray that God reveal the whole truth so your father can be set free. Because I know he's innocent. My love. Thank you so much for understanding. What can I do without you? I love you so much. I love you too. Please, promise me this will not end our relationship. I promise. My love, I'm all yours, okay? <laughs> you have my word. Whom if a kingdom ought to be secured and protected by heavily armed guards. Look at it. This is good. Very good. I saw the other group outside and they were looking very good. Very good. Uh, Azuma. My lord. Henceforth, you are the chief security officer of the palace. Yes, ma'am. Anyway, as you can see, I deserve a drink. Maya Waraka Kuo. This job I'm doing at the palace is not an easy job, you know. I don't know. I don't know. You're badass. Yeah, nigga, man. You're right. You deserve it. And you know what? 
it's been specially arranged for you. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you went to the guy. I know. I know. Oh no! Oh no! Take your eyes off from the vultures meat. Because it's never good to eat. He came down. Stop dancing so to get a dance. Because it is the dance of the spirit. It will do you good if you heed to my advice. A stubborn housewife follows the corpse to the grave. I am nothing but a messenger of the gods. And I have come to deliver the message from the gods. I shall take my leave now. What was that? That thing. Don't mind that idiot. Ah, he is supposed to be the chief priest. The protector of the land and the people of whom we have a kingdom. But ask him. Where was he when the Igwe, your father, died? Where was he? The Igwe was poisoned to death. Where was he? He was supposed to protect your father. He was caught napping on duty. He comes here to... Can you imagine him? Don't mind the idiot. He's a fool. A big fool. Very big fool. And I don't want to see him in this palace again. Yes! His head served on a plate. Claire! Hey, Igwe, don't worry. I'm here. I'm going to replace him with another chip. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Follow me. Azuna, you heard what Igwe said. Okay? Anytime you see him cross that corner, his head on the plate. Okay. You're not yourself. Who's troubling you? I, I hope you're not brooding over your father's condition. Open, please. Get rid of those feelings. Don't make it your guide. Please put it off, okay? Did you hear me? Obim, I'm talking to you and you're not responding. It's been moody for some days now. And if people have met fruitless and fortune, they this feeling of his. I believe one can recover on you now. Please help us. We don't want to lose him. It's more like a father to us now. Please do something. Obim, did you hear your sister? Is that fair? You're hurting your younger ones. They should be cheered up by you. Okay, I... I understand your plight. But please, do not be doomed by it. Okay? Do it. Obim, I am not supposed to do this because of our condition. But I would do it for you. For you to brighten up. Go on.
Okay, so what do you say to me? Oh, thank you very much. Mm. Yeah, um, I think I feel better now. That's what I wanted to achieve. <laughs> That's good. Is it bright enough? <laughs> mm -hmm. So, everything with my two own very eyes. She was dancing on her own accord. And that cheered him up? Yes, my princess. He got a smartish relief as she danced. I witnessed everything. Ha! I see. So, Joa is doing everything within her powers to get Obina to love her. Tell me he doesn't need me. My princess, Obina needs you. I think he needs you. It's just that he lack the pragmatic means of winning his heart. What I'm trying to say is that you need to do something to knock the prince. The what? The what? Sorry. The Ujuma off the way. My princess, she's gradually winning his heart. And I know you cannot afford to lose Obina. My princess. Ujugo is right. You have to prove to Obina that you're better than Ujuma in every aspect. That way, you can easily corrupt his mind against Ujuma. Once you get into his heart. I've been here for the past 30 minutes now and I refuse to say anything. Why? You don't want me here? I wonder why you're keeping quiet on me. I hope it's, it has got nothing to do with the little misunderstanding we had a few days back. Because I already told you to forget about it. I cannot believe you're this unforgiving. Not that. You can see his countenance is sad. Maybe he needs you to cheer him up. Cheer him up? Mm. Ha! 
am I supposed to? Cheer him up. I'll dance for you. And by the time I'm done digging it down here, <laughs> you have lots of smiles on your face. Hey, I'm a very good dancer. Yeah, just get ready for one very good show. think so. I wish to refer you to a princess with you if you really want to be a good dancer. What? Yes. Running out of patience with Tobina. Why? Because of the little misunderstanding he and I had. We had a few days ago. You needed to have seen how Obina and his younger ones. How they humiliated me today. I never felt so insignificant and stupid in my whole life. Oh. And I think I'm going to hate him. Amazing. Why is your relationship with him I always feel that it's Close to unusual misunderstanding. Because Ujuma, he has corrupted his mind against me. That's just the truth of the matter. Oh. Oh. No longer continue with him again. I can't stand embarrassment oh. anymore. <laughs> oh. But one thing's for sure. 
opener will regret this. No. I swear to God. He regret it? No. Oh, no, Ma. Don't be that harsh with him. Give him one more chance. Okay? Just one more chance. I'm so short of words. I don't know how to say thank you for everything you've done for me. Oh, come on, you don't have Sometimes to say I'm so ashamed of myself. Hey, okay, stop it. Um, I don't know how to thank you for everything you've done for me. You're so loving, you're so caring. <laughs> Sometimes I'm so Aw, look at you both. This is so cold. It's over now, and the harlot he abandoned me for. Olama, what part of I hate you don't you understand? Hmm? Or was I drunk the day I asked you to stay off me? Listen, I hate you. You disgust me. Don't you understand? You know, it's very, very funny the amount of audacity you have to talk to me now. It's amazing. When I look back and I picture the inferior Obina that I picked up from the gutters. And now, you can talk to me. Oh, and why is that? Because you've done well for yourself. Starting with attracting the attention of the bastard here that calls herself a princess. What did you just call me? Oh. A bastard! You heard me. My love, my love, just take it easy. Let me take care of this pop tart. Hola, oh, mom, whatever you call yourself. I want you to take a look at this girl here. Hmm? Take a look at the Junwa. She's the princess. But look at yourself. Look at yourself. Take a look at her. She's a million times better than you are. Who are you? You're just the daughter to the Onowu, and yet you carry yourself around, pretending to be what you're not. But take a look at her. Take a look at Ujunwa. She's the princess. She's the queen of this land. And yet, humility runs in her veins. Hmm? Look at her. She's humble. She's loving. She's caring. She's everything to me. And yet, you had the audacity to tell her or call her a prostitute while you're the cheap harlot. Oh, yes. What? Oh, yes. Did you just say I said that? for you again okay. you see those sorrowful tears you made me cry for you mm -hmm. I'll cry again but I promise you you regret it it's a promise and you my darling are supposed to be ashamed of your beautiful self you know why because the shameless you is frolicking and mesmerizing with the same bastard that murdered your father. Now that is a height of stupidity and senselessness. You see you and you. You both will hear from me. Olama will crush you. You know what I mean. But losers. Kill them. Yeah. 
So all this scheming is to corrupt Obina's mind against me. A guy I picked up from nowhere. I dusted out the human in him. And from nowhere, you come out with your stinking body and try to corrupt his mind against me. To snatch him from me. How did you think that was going to be possible? You never win all our mind anything. I'm going to warn you not to allow me to do anything rash. Because if I do, it will be disastrous. Lama, go ahead and do whatever you feel you can do. Honey, don't beg for it. For all you know, it will be very, very deadly. Just go ahead. What else can you do? If not, shoot me again. <laughs> you didn't really think I was responsible for that hit, did you? Of course I know you were responsible. Or was it because I kept quiet? Hmm. Well, since you happen to know everything, did you also know it was a warning? What? Uh-huh. I thought as much. And the worst will happen to you if you don't step aside in the next few days. I don't talk too much. I prefer action. Get on top. Your wife. What if I say no? Alama, I said, get out of my way. And I asked, what? If I say no, what will you do? What will you do? Oh, let me see. That will be nothing. Hola, ma. I don't know what you're doing here. And whatever it is, I don't care. Listen, I want you to stay away from me. I don't need your love. I don't need you around me. You actually said you, you, you've come to reanimate my life, but I'm sorry, I don't need it. Leave me alone. I want to stay alone. Second chance. Well, I'm, I'm sorry, I don't need your second chance. Okay? Because I've made up my mind not to see your rich face again. Well, I am poor. Then leave me alone. I don't want. That reminds me. I thought you said you were going to deal with me. What are you living for? Hmm? Or do you think I am afraid of you?
cry for you. Olama cried for you. Do you know that I've never, I've never worked for anybody in my entire life. But you, <laughs> you made me, you made me cry out sorrowful tears for you, you, <laughs> but it's okay, it's all good, I just promise you. Why are you barking more than you bite? Huh? You make too much noise. Leave my house. A house? Well, we shall see. Peasant. Oh, oh no, oh no. Oh God, no. What are you doing on that throne? By the way, where, where, where is that? hell is going on here, man? Is this a dream or what? <laughs> Oxford nigga is out. It is not a dream. Neither it is in a movie. <laughs> For your information, you are standing before His Royal Majesty, Igwe Ike Naobi, one and only Igwe Nega of Imwefe Kingdom. So, urge you to, to bow before his majesty for your life's sake. Makadia Mama. <laughs> <laughs> What 
has gotten over you. Anyway, I'm not in the mood for this joke you guys are joking here now. Okay? Dad! 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 Joseph the Dreamer. You don't. You'll soon. Well, let's let's help him get that. Dad! 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 To your father, you know, I will give anything to you. Tell me what is it, and I will do it for you. All right, talk to your daddy. Come on, open, 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 and disappointed me. Open, and abandoned me for you. Who's open now? Wait a minute. Mazibi's son? Yes. What did he do to you? He said... He said... He said that he hates me! And that he doesn't want to ever set his eyes on me again. That idiot! That wretched fool said that to you? Yes. It's alright, my dear, okay? Never mind, okay? I'll, I'm going to talk sense into him. I'm going to bring him back to you, okay? No, okay. no, father. No. I don't want you to talk to him. Don't talk to anybody. I'm going to hate him. Him again in my life too. <laughs> I want the memories of him completely erased from my heart. <laughs> Father, I want open. I want his life terminated. Yes, yes, his non existence will give my heart so much joy. To be alive and continue see. See you love and I'm doing it together. It will kill me. It will kill me. And I may commit suicide. No, no, no. I'll commit suicide. No, no, no. You will not get to that. You know, I suddenly lost contact with you guys. I, I 
got no message. I got no, no calls. No. I've been trying to reach you guys. Don't know what is happening. I got no call. I got no message. Mom, this is bad. It's bad, mom. It's too bad. It's not your fault. He cannot tell everybody he called you. But I were too busy to come back. What? That was... What, mom? Oh, that is Aaron's nonsense. He cannot never call me anytime, any day. He never did. You lie, Uzona. You lie. I informed you and you told me that you were so goddamn bloody freaking busy. Ikena, how could you do this to me? You know that you are so wicked. You betrayed me before the entire kingdom. Why? Ikena, why? Shut up, Uzana. You betrayed yourself. You sold your birthright. You want to know how? I'll tell you how. You never bothered to call for even just, just, just one day to know how these peeps were doing. No! You let the gold that was put in your hands slip away. So what do you expect, nigga? Ikena, do you know that you have, you are a devil's incarnate? You're inhuman! Do you know you have the heart of a devil? How, how could you do this to your brother? Something terrible, Ifebu. I don't know, I can't really explain it. It just. I don't know, I don't know. Okay. <clears throat> My brother, listen. I believe you're troubled about Papa's situation. But you don't have to be. Okay, we have to stay strong. I don't want us to be negative. I want us to be positive about this whole thing. Eh? Ifebu, 
Ifebu. I pray so. Brother, I just pray so. Please, can you get off this mood? Eh? Let's go. So, brother, mm -hmm. tell me, how was your, remove your hand, how was your acting with Princess Ijumu? Well, it went splendid, mm -hmm. as usual. Mm -hmm. Yes. And guess what? What? She gave me a gift. A gift? Yes. What is that? Do you want to know what it is? Yes, I do. <laughs> Let me show you. <laughs> yeah! Ah! <laughs> That is a gold chain. Mm. You mean the princess gave you this? Yes. She gave me this to show me that she loves me so much. Yeah, this is beautiful. Very beautiful. Yes, it's beautiful. Wow. You like it? Obina, huh? Please, can I have it? I like it. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> you like what? Uh, wait, let me see. I'm coming. I'll give you. I'll give you. Wait. Are you? Are you? Are you alright? Eh? So you want to tell me to give you what the princess gave me? So you're trying to tell me that we both share the same love, but she can still get another one. No, 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 no. no. I can't give you. Please, it's a now. gift. A gift is not supposed to be given out. Okay, okay. Listen, I'm going to give you something else. But that would be on one condition. Okay? <laughs> you see those by dirty clothes inside? <laughs> you are going to wash all of them. <laughs> but you don't even know what I want to give you and you're frowning your face. Hmm? But I want... No, I'm going to... Don't worry. I have something to give you. Something very, very special. Okay. okay. But you have to wash those shirts. Go and wash those shirts. clothes. Now, well, I will only do that after I've seen what you want to give. I'll give you, trust me. I'm going to give you. But this one, this one belongs to me. Uh, this one is my own. <laughs> oh yeah, let's go inside. This <laughs> mm, touch is wrong. I don't know what's wrong.
innocent child shall not die of what he knows not. No, ma'am. No! No. Come back here. <laughs> Come back here. You don't need to run. <sighs> Who are you? Shh. Come with me. Come with you to where? I don't know you. For the sake of your life. Just come with me. Inside Mazi base compound. Yes. Oh, God. Iwe, what sort of family is this? Eh? What are we going to do about this? Mazi Ibe and his family. In the morning, Mazi Ibe and his family. In the afternoon, Mazi Ibe and his family. In the evening, Mazi Ibe and his family. This family is beginning to constitute a nuisance to this kingdom. Well, Iwe, you know what penalty is such? I don't need to tell you. Igwe, in my opinion, I will say let the law of the land be enforced. Let the young man be castrated or buried alive. Exactly. Yes. No. No. Exactly. No. That is an abomination. I don't... Not in my kingdom. Not in my kingdom. No nigger will bring disgrace to this kingdom. Never. God. Something is wrong with Brother Obina. Something is wrong with him. <laughs> Obina. 
Obina. Where is Obina? Obina. O Obina is not in. Did you find him? The fool is nowhere to be found! Please, please, don't, don't hold on. Shut, Shut up, you rapist! Rapist? How dare you come about a rapist? Shut up! <laughs> How many of you to this entire kingdom? What are you talking about? You cannot control your manhood. Better go and get a wife. That's all. Yes. That's right. That's it. And not to go about defiling our young beautiful girls. No. Once again, Igwe, good decision. Yes. Yes. Good one. You should be ashamed of yourself. What kind of a man are you? Shameless man! Look, Look at you! 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 Look at you!
So I have right to take my decision. Decision. Hear me? What I have right to take my decision. What decision? Eh? Uh, what decision? What, what decision can you make? Your daughter was raped by Mazi Besson and cannot do anything. And you are even supporting the Igwe to set him free. What and you call yourself a man. Okay. What was your daughter looking for at that time of the night? What? Why would they let me? Why? I will not support evil. I cannot support evil. Nobody was supposed to suffer for what he did. Not the entire family. You hear me? Mm. Obi not know what he has done. That's why he ran away. But he is his brother. The tradition of the land says any man that rapes any woman, all the male in the land will be killed. So tradition must hold. What do you know about tradition? 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 You know about tradition? Besides, how do you know that that is not a frame of against your people? How do you know? Well, well, I will not stand here and argue with you. You see you. You see you. I will kill you here before I will kill you. Onyeka, you, don't touch you. my daughter. Oh. Well, don't touch my daughter. Oh. Like a mother, like a daughter. Mm. See? Like a mother, like a daughter. Mm. You are own. It's a lie. It's a lie. It will not happen. It will, it will not happen. Small time, it will expose. You will see. Mark my word. You will not stay here and nag, you nag with me. How can you stay here and nag with me? You cannot stay when you are a fool. Big fool like you. Are you a man or you bury me? Idiot. How about sure you didn't even charm me to marry me? Eh? You will confess, oh? You will confess. You see what it cost? Did you see what it cost? If I talk, you will not listen to me. You will not listen Please, 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 Beautiful for him. Uh, is he good? Let us put him like that. Bring him, bring him, let's put him like that. Bring him, bring him, bring him. Bring him. Come, is you you shut down. Put his face down. Put his face down. Yes. 
Idiot, on a le bon. Ah 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 This is your palace now. You enjoy this? You enjoy it? A young virgin. You don't want to enjoy your palace. We are the Lord yes. ourselves. Yes, <laughs> we get out. <laughs> 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 May his soul rest in power. Amen. Amen. His soul cannot rest in power. Let his soul rest in power. This is power. This is. Person is not the right person. What about his elder brother? We have killed him. Are you sure? Yes, and I, we have sent him to the permanent site. When we wanted to arrest him, he fought us. Then we killed him and his sister. Good, 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 good. So, what about the cops then? We left his stretched body at the back of their No, house. no. No! You should have hidden it somewhere. Or better still, bury it where nobody will ever find it. Oh my God. Now listen. Alright? No problem. Now you will go back and ensure you dispose of the body, okay? Now go, go, go. I don't want anybody to see us together, man. Go! This house belongs to my late good friend, Mr. Oji. He died on a road accident with his wife on their way coming from Umule village. It was so terrible. So terrible. Um, that's quite sad. But now, does that mean we'll be living here all alone by ourselves? No, Obina. He has a surviving son by name Chima. We shall stay here with him. Yeah. 
but tonight what would be the situation of my younger ones at home you you know they they, they don't know i left the house obina you talk a lot the girls are there to protect them and you know the girls protect those that they favor and you are aware of it let's go in Hey! Get down now, Hooker. You're going to answer. Now you're joking, you're welcome. So, after all these years, you still remember me? My son, Chima, I always remember you. But you know, I'm always a busy man. No, I, 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 I understand. I understand, eh? Once again, you're welcome. You're welcome, brother. You're welcome, man. Eh? Thank you, Chima. Ah. You know me? Nay. Nay, who is he? Oh. His name is Obinda. The son of my good friend. And he's here to seek refuge. Ah. Refuge? Does that mean there is a problem in their land? Chima, something like that. Hmm? Something like that. But I'm not going to tell you more. For now. Because I'm very thirsty. Uh, nah, yeah, please, 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 I am sorry. I should, I, I should have welcomed you better. Eh? Instead of asking you so many questions. Please, nah, make yourself comfortable. Eh? Please, you your welcome. Make yourself comfortable. Let me get the key from the bag. Eh? No, 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 not each other, not each other, no, man. Oh, no, the nigger. <laughs> oh, no, the nigger. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine. Yeah. Every day you look very beautiful. More beautiful and more beautiful every day. You know, and I've been wanting to see you. Just like each time I want to come round your house, I see your husband and I. <laughs> I take the other way, I pretend as if... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Chief. I want you to be my mistress. I don't understand. <laughs> Let me ask you. Were you forced to marry your husband, Onyeka? No, I was not. Kichi, take a good look at us. Look at, you see the difference between your husband and I. Kichi, look at how beautiful you are. Allow me to take good care of this beauty of yours. Okay, I will do anything for you. Okay, anything. I'm it's your no. It's your no. Go, 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 go. Just go. Go, please, go. Go, 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 go. Get you wait, wait, wait. Eh? There's no need to be the hall. This is Ono the nigger. We have taken control of the whole town. Okay? Let me tell you something. You saw what happened at the palace that day. About that, that boy that raped your daughter. Yes. I was behind the decision of Igwe. I was the one who told Igwe what to do. Are you serious? Yes. I told him to finish the boy, man. Finish him up. Really? It's, look, Kachi, the niggas have taken control. <laughs> I said we have taken over. <laughs> we have taken over. Listen. Okay. When I talk yourself, I don't, I don't mean words when I talk. I don't know who you are. This is just the beginning. Thank you. Uh, I will even buy you a car. Car? For me? I'm going to have a car. <laughs> you, know, you know what happened? The only thing I want you to do for me is this. Okay? Since the niggas have taken over the entire town. Nobody dares honor the nigger. What I want you to do is this. From today, I don't want that wretched husband of yours 
to sleep with you anymore. I don't want him to come. Don't let him not even touch you. What you now do is this. Later in the evening, you see me in the nigger script. <laughs> what is that? Nigger script, man. That's the way we. Nigger. Nigger. Girls have taken over. Nigger. <laughs> yes, we'll be like. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know why he can actually do this to me. Mom, how come he cannot have the heart to take my rights while I am still alive? Why? Eh? Mom, I'm just trying to handle this with kid gurus. Know that I'm ignorant of the appropriate action to take. See, he cannot is my biological brother. So I wouldn't want to harm him. Okay? This is cheap, man! Calm down, my son. Please calm down. Okay? Mom? Please calm down. Mom, how do you expect me to calm down over this? How do you expect me to calm down? Tell me! Hey? Things are going astray and you expect me to calm down? Mom! Ikena is sitting on my throne, remember? I know, my son. I know. But you have to calm down first. In order to avoid any impulsive action. Look, Ikenna is being deceived. He has a powerful hand behind him. Uno is behind all this and you know it. Mom, no. Remove Uncle Uno out of this. If I may ask, was it Uncle Uno who that asked Ikenna to sell his conscience? Was it Uncle Uno who that asked Ikenna? To abandon his story over there and come back to this land? Mom, listen. He has strategically planned this a long time ago. I am beginning to suspect he had hand in that state. Uzona. Yes! He strategically planned the murdering of dad in order to take over before my arrival. That he has succeeded doing. But, relax. I know what to do. Okay? I must take what rightfully belongs to me. Is on the world right yes. what belongs to you will surely come to you. Well, please, you have to let me handle this with care. Look, Ikenna is my son. I know how to talk some senses into him and at least make him realize the implication of what he's doing. Please, my son, please Mom, I beg you. Mom, I will not dare it. I will not. I will not take it, Mom. Because it will look as if you to plead on my behalf. Okay? I cannot beg Ikena to release what rightfully belongs to me. I can never. Like I told you, Mom, I know what to do. Leave everything for me. I know how to handle him. Okay? Uzo. Uzo Anna. Uzo. Oh, God. God of our life. Bigger than me has befallen me. Look at my children. Oh God, help me. Help me. Nkechi. 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 Nkechi, what have I done to you? Why can't I touch you as, as my wife? Are you not my wife? Or am I not your husband? What is the problem, Nkechi? Eh? Am I not man enough? Eh, Nkechi, am I not man enough? Eh? Okay. <laughs> it's 
okay, I can't remember. Is it because of that a small book when we have the other time? Okay, that's no problem. That I just want to uh, prove like a man. I just want to, <laughs> I just want to uh, uh, make like a man, uh, to, to act like a man. If that is a problem, oh yeah, that's no problem. I surrender. Eh? So, okay, let us, <laughs> you know, you know, every time I see this your face, I remember my grandma. <laughs> In case... It's your Dikwagema. Are you alright? Uh -huh. You want to rape me like they raped your daughter? But Mkechi, this thing is not a joke. Are you not my wife? Mkechi. You are a useless husband. Hey! You can only call me your wife. But my pants, you will never see again. Hey! Father, are you watching? Are you watching, Father? Do you see what this woman is doing me? The woman I called my wife. You are there, watching. Father, you have to do something, oh. Hmm. You have to do something. Oh, yeah. You must do something, Father. Oh, yeah. This is my wife. I married her with my money. Oh, yeah. hmm. Oh, yeah. hmm. If you like, hmm. report me to your great great grandfather. Report me to your great great grandmother. Mark today. My pants, you will never see again. Okay. I know. I know what it is. What is it? What is it, Soyeka? What is it? Yeah, I'm mm -hmm. Listen, don't turn to another thing. Mukechi? So you mean this thing? Yes. Right to the date, Dad. You will never, never again. <laughs> okay. What is it? Please, you want me to shout? Do you want me to shout? I will shout and call it. If you don't, don't want me to sleep in this house, don't do this same for me. Don't do this same for me now. Don't do this same for me. Don't touch me. You know, don't do this same for me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't 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 touch me. Don't touch me. I don't want you to touch me. Don't touch me. Yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Did you really kill him? Or do we just die the matter like that? But Asuna, why did you suggest that we, we, we lie at the first time? Oh. Ah, shut up! So what do you mean by that? You expected us to tell Uno that he disappeared in the air? Then Uno will start clapping for you. You are a fool, guys. Stop, stop, stop. Get down the walls. Who should, who should be taking nice the way forward? Other than calling ourselves names, eh? The question now is what do we do? That is the question. Guys, the next line of action is what I suggested earlier. We shall embark on a sorrow search. Find him, kill him. We must have gone around the town that he's dead. But we all know that he's still alive. We need to have just made the point. We must find him and we must kill him. And that is the only way we can escape on us off. Shh. So come, guys. We have all heard what Uzonna has just narrated to us. And uh, you all can bear me witness that uh, what Uzonna has just told us is quite different from what Ikenna said initially. Uzona here have denied that nobody informed him about the Igwe's death. Why Ikenna is hey, still maintaining? My friend! He is Igwe! Is Igwe. Is our Igwe! Call him Igwe! Show some rest! Is our Igwe! Call him Igwe! Okay, okay. Igwe! Better. That's better. Why he is still maintaining that? He was duly informed. What else are we going to do if not to return the throne to the rightful owner, whether informed or not informed? Not this throne. 
Not while I'm alive. Never! No bloody asshole can take this throne away from me and know this. I am prepared for anything. You can try. Hmm. Igwe, don't back when you have dog that can back for you. Eh? The gods of the land have chosen you to be the next Igwe of this kingdom. Don't bother yourself. Stop bothering yourself. Leave the matter. Who chose him? Oh, I asked you who chose him as a new Igwe of this the God, community. The gods of the land chose him as a new Igwe. Chose the gods of the kingdom of course. I greet you, chief and elders of the kingdom. I bring you words from the gods. <laughs> mm. The gods has chosen Ikenna as the next Igwe of this kingdom. Mm. Ah. Uzana lost the throne the moment he refused to return and honor his late father, Igwe Obi. <laughs> And her spirit is so vexed and angry with him. But favor Ikena. <laughs> mm. Let no one, let no one touch the chosen one of the gods or invite their rot or invite their rot on his entire generation. He will have ear. Let him hear. The fly that refuses to hear follows the dead body to grave. These are the message from the gods. Well, you will need you. We have had it all. Yes. Uncle? You? No. No, I can't believe this. Who is he? But I, I never knew him as a chief priest of this kingdom. Well, for your information, dumbass. <laughs> he is now the chief priest of this kingdom. What? This is brutal conspiracy. This is victimization. What? No. It is wickedness. It is wickedness, man. The gods will, will, will never forgive you people. He will never. Thank you very much for accepting me. I'm really grateful. It's okay. It's okay. You're welcome. welcome. I, I was going to ask you, why don't you tell me about your land? You know I'm not familiar with this place. My land? My land is a land of peace and hospitality. Okay. The people are very wonderful people. Very wonderful people. They are cordial and very generous. Mm. <laughs> I can see that because I... The young boys and girls I met out there, they, 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 they are so full of a good sense of humor. <laughs> see, 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 we love strangers and we accommodate them. But what you just saw there is the beginning. Because those boys, they will come back, they will want to make you their friend. Really? I'm not going to allow it. Why? For your own safety. I don't want everybody in this village to know that you're here. Because before you know it, words will go around and it will even get your own village. Huh? Okay. You, you, you need to eat something. 
let me make food for you. No, but I'm full. I just I just had food with uh, uh, Nayon Joku before he left. I was watching you. You did not eat anything. Huh? I was watching you. Relax, let me make you food. If you can plug all in. Chima, thank you for everything. that he cannot have been chosen by God to take over the throne from me. What have I done wrong? How? Well, I'm sure that the spirit of my late father will bear me witness that it wasn't my fault. It wasn't my fault. But why then should the ghost turn their back against me? Why? Uzama. You don't have to bother yourself. It's obvious Mazio Nobu and Ikena conspired with that man to lie against you. He is not the right chief priest. The true chief priest, Njoko, was banned from this palace by Mazio Nobu and Ikena. So it's very obvious they employed that man to concate those lies against you. But this is strange. This is strange. I mean, how did I offend on Kundu that he hates me that much? So, he's truly the one behind all this. I was watching him in the palace the other day. He seemed so determined to get me off the way. You know, you doubted me when I told you about him. I know all the atrocities Ono who committed in this palace and the kingdom by extension. This is incredible. Incredible, Mom! Well, I'm not cheated. My only happiness is that the days of the wicked are numbered. He shall live to reap every seed he sowed in this power. But I'm not going to wring my arms and wait till that day. I am not, Mom! Mom, I need my throne. I need my throne, man. I need my throne. I must get what I want. I need my throne. Mom, I, I, I need my throne. I need my throne, Mom. Zona, take it easy. You will get your throne, okay? Just take it easy. No, we couldn't find him. We don't see him anywhere. We don't find him. We don't see him. Jay! Come, did you go to his Matana home? Madam, that's where we've been since morning. We've been all around the village looking for him. We can't, we can't even see his trace. Hey. Hey. We can't find him. Hey. This is terrible. So, where must he be by now? My dear, I don't know. I just say this guy don't die. I just say he don't die. We don't enter inside one forest and big white animal and don't kill us. You shut up, my friend. Look, we don't have to assume anything in this circumstance. We all know how dead you know who is. We are going to fight. In fact, to me. the fact remains that we are going to look for him, whether dead or alive. Yes. The search continues until we find him. Yes. 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 Let's go.
I understand how you feel, my dear. But crying will never bring him back again. Rather, you'll be causing yourself harm. Try and then sponge his memory off your mind, please. Mm, mother, I can't. I can't. Mother, I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. It's okay. It's okay. Stop crying. Stop crying, okay? <laughs> All right. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It is my right foot from Sinao. Legacy control. No who has joined the race for that He has the final say hey, In this palace Niggas, niggas, igwe de nigga Brother who's on now Be coral for your life How do you go? Sorry for remembering you. Please forgive me. There's nothing wrong in that. There's nothing wrong if one wants to know the history of where he found himself. Not just that. So many things reminds me of them. cherished it a lot. She hardly sells them in the market. She preserves them for visitors and members of our family because the orange is very sweet. It's the best orange we have here. Among all the oranges we have, that's the best. Sometimes when I'm lonely, I seek companionship by climbing around the trees. You know, ever since my parents died, I became a solitary child. I like being more of an introvert. No brother to talk to, no sister to share my feelings with. That's why I thank the stars now that I have you. 
least I have a brother I can talk to when I need to. Someone I can share my emotions with. I'm very happy to have you here, Obini. I am grateful. Very, very grateful. Chima. Right now you are more like a brother to me. And I want to thank you for everything. I'm so grateful. I mean, it's not easy. I am a stranger, but it is nice of you to have, you know, brought me in as a brother. It's okay. It's okay. Alright. Be careful. Let me help you with one. I'm sure you can leave this. I can't, I can't, don't worry. I, I used to fetch water in my house. <laughs> Alright, tell me what you need. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> don't If there's any way I have offended you, please find it in your house to forgive me. We are just human. No man is perfect. I must have trespassed against you in one way or the other. Uncle, please forgive me. I beg you in the name of our Lord. Listen, my son. Sir, you have not offended me in any way. I love you like a son. I would never allow any evil to befall you. God forbid it. My only problem is that I am not comfortable with the attitude you exuded during your father's death. Who's on now? You should have come home to honor your father and then succeed him on the throne. But because you did not do that, that was why you lost the throne. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Honestly, I wasn't informed about it. I only came back to know what might be wrong because I lost every contact with home, you know. I never knew my dad died and has been buried. As a matter of fact, uncle, I need my throne. It is my birthright. I'm not going to contest it with anybody. Uncle, please. I, I know you can do something. That is why I'm here. Please, do something. I've heard you. I, I will see what I can do about it. Oh, thank you, Uncle. Uh, I, I, I appreciate it. I will appreciate it. May God bless tell you, now that you've chosen to be a summer fly, I'm going to deal with you the way you never imagined. You know, you must regret ever doing this. 
Believe me, I'm going to kill you if you do not give up the throne. Look me in the eye. In case you have forgotten, I am still the most dreaded Melody of Oxford. I do not entertain threats. You better watch what you say to me. Ikeman! Do you realize you're talking to me? You want to see my hostility, right? Good. Now listen. You have two days. Two more days to hand off the throne, or else, or else what? I will unleash it on you. Or else what? Why don't you unleash it right now? Hmm? Are you scared? Are you? Are you lily livered? <laughs> One candid advice for you, brother. Leave this palace. Leave this kingdom. Leave this village. Go back to the UK and study. You are fighting a lost heritage and it's gonna consume you. Take it from me, boy. Huh. Ikena, do you realize I'm still your elder brother? Look, do you know that this palace belongs to me? And I have every right to walk you out of this palace. Do you know that? And do you know that I have every right to instruct this guard right here to cut off your head? Oh. And I'm, yes, and I'm telling you, in just, in just a matter of seconds, your head will be right here. Yes. If you misbehave, your head will be sitting right here in front of me. Ikena, you have the audacity to talk to me like this. You have the guts to talk to me like this. Good. All right. Let me tell you. So, you take me for a fool because I'm be taking it easy with you, right? <laughs> Listen, let me tell you. The trouble you're looking for, man, <laughs> I'm going to give it to you double. Bring it home. Man, I'm going to see. Ikena, you're going to hear from me sooner. Life and our rights. Bring it on. We're gonna see. Let's you see. Can, uh, you? Yeah. We're gonna see. You gonna hear from me. Life and our rights. Something more I'd like uh, you to understand. Okay. Me? Hmm? Yeah. We must not encourage silence anymore. Mm -hmm. It is time we did something um, about your brother Ozona's continuous threats before it is too late. Can't do anything. I know him too well. He ain't got no balls. Besides, he's my brother, so I wouldn't want to hurt him. Then I want to assume you do not want to ascend the throne because your brother, who's up now, is not sleeping over it. Never. I say it again, never. Nobody can take this throne away from me. Uh -uh. And 
and I'm sure he did not want me to tell you what he told me he was going to do to you when he visited me earlier on. Or do you? Really? Hmm. Huh. All right. So what do I do? Because right now I, I'm thinking along the line. He may be plotting evil. So what do I do? dead but you're still alive in, in my heart I, I never knew you would be separated this way I wish Providence had, had made a way of escape for you in the din of your foes but the gods knows why and, you all will remain indelible in my heart. <coughs> I wish you all a peaceful rest in the land beyond. <coughs> I 
We love you all and your memories will remain indelible in my heart. I love you all, Bima. <laughs> Say another five minutes. What? <laughs> I swear, I didn't know you better. I swear. You're kidding me right now. <laughs> Seriously? Oh, please. Okay, my friend is here. So see you soon. Bye. Hey, girl. Hi, hi. Sweet. Oh, oh. Look at you. Where are you going? Like you don't know. You kept me waiting for so long. Come on, sit your ass down. Okay, where am I going? So what's up? Hola, ma. Mm. Did you hear the rumor going around town? What's that? That old Bina also died in that incident. Oh honey, are you just hearing that? He died though. He died. That beast of a boy, he's dead. And it serves him right. I still can't get over how me. I stood so low to love the idiots. But he preferred the bitch that called herself the princess. Where are they now? <laughs> I promised them I was going to deal with that. I did. It's so sad. Oh. I pity for the young man. Oh. How do you mean? Hola, ma. It's sad. Is it? Oh. I mean, just imagine how that family suddenly came to a total extinction. Hmm. The old father has been jailed for life. All the children have been killed. It's sad. Well. I mean, it's... Uh, Listen, listen. I don't regret anything about Obinus death. Absolutely nothing. If I'm to have my way, he will die a thousand times over. That's right, I said so. <laughs> if there's anything I regret a little bit, that would be the death of his younger ones, which was an accident. And it's okay. I mean, shit happens. <laughs> oh. And Obina. If he gets a chance to reincarnate, he should know better than to mess with people like Olama. Uh, he will shine his eyes next time. You're talking so strange. Hmm. Okay, we should get going. Aha! Uh -huh. Enough of the bad luck people talk. Alright? Where are my girls? Aren't you go?
who else if not Ikena? Yes, of course. It's obvious Ikena wants to get Uzona off the way. So maybe he sent assassins to murder him. But thank God he didn't succeed. Thank God. Thank God. The doctor said it would be fine. What makes you think Ikena will do this to his brother? Mother. Ikena does not want to give up the throne. He can do anything to retain it. So it's possible he attempted murder on, on Ozona because that's the only way he can retain that throne. Ozona on his own part does not want to give up the fight. How can he give up the fight? Is it not his right? If only Borizona would listen, I would advise he travel back to Oxford for the meantime because he cannot seem bent on eliminating him. That is the wisest choice. But he won't listen. I want to have a word with you. Mm. Oh, there's no problem. You're not supposed to ask this. Of course you know there's a serious problem. <laughs> All right. Sit. Okay. So, what is it that can't wait till tomorrow? Better still, some other day. I don't think I can wait till tomorrow or some other day. I want to know why you've refused to see Uzona in the hospital for the past three weeks. With what? Hey, come on, are you dumb? Don't you know what I'm sitting on? You can now. Hey! Igwe. Igwe. 
tell me you are this heartless? Your biological brother, whom some unknown assassin attempted murder on, has been lying helplessly in the hospital for the past three weeks. And you've not gone to know how he's faring, all on the ground that you've been occupied with some activities. Tell me, what sort of activity is more important than the life of your own brother? Hey, just spare me the headache, little sister. If you're so dumb to know, I'm sure. I'm sure, I'm sure these dudes know that I'm a very busy man. And I had a very busy day, right? So... Don't invade my privacy. You cannot! Hey! Hey! For the very last time? Igwe. Or better still, Igwe the Nenga. You are so disgusting! Something is wrong somewhere. I keep having terrible nightmares about my family. All is not well. Obinna, I know this is difficult. But you have to endeavor to think less of issues concerning your family for now. Your younger ones are fine. Okay? Just like Njoku said, you are their primary target. But the gods delivered you from their wicked hands. So what makes you think that that same god will not protect your younger ones? Huh? You have to adapt yourself to this present situation. That's all you need to do. Stop allowing all these ugly incidents from the past to haunt you now. Your younger ones will be fine. Chima, you don't understand. In February, I don't even know where I am now. Eh? I don't know my father's where I'm not. They will be fine. Your younger ones will be fine now. Just pray for them and be optimistic. That's all you need to do. Pray for them. What is wrong with you now? Every time, every time you're looking bad, like, like you've gotten news already that something has happened. Gossip, so they are accusations, so they are accusing fingers, so don't mean a thing. Why? Right? They don't mean a thing. They're like water poured on the surface of a stone. It washes away just immediately and leaves the stone glittering more than before. Now, listen, let me tell you something. You see this mouth? God gave us this mouth for us to talk with. And if you don't use it, 
The mouth smells. It's going to smell. So you have to use it. Your silence is going to keep them away from you. Let them, let them talk. Like I care. Of course, you know me. I don't. I don't bloody care. Let them talk. Bloody assholes. But you know, Uncle, this this uh, Uzonna's issue. That pig. The boys failed. Yeah, they failed woefully. So, what do we do? There are so many ways to kill a rat. But the most important thing now is that he's gone, isn't it? Of course. So relax! Relax! Brother, since you're fast recovering, I don't think it's safe for you to return to the palace now. I suggest you fly back to Oxford and return when this blaring storm is over. Let the gods fight your cause, okay? I disagree with you, Johan. That is, you expect me to accept defeat by Ikenna, my own younger brother. No. May the gods forbid. I can never run for Ikena. Rather, he will run for me. Okay? Ujuma, let me tell you the truth. Ikena has dared me. It is now my turn to show him the stuff I'm made of. Father. That is it. I do not want you to go into any warfare with Ikena. Ikena is a beast. Fine. Ikena is inhuman. Good. I do not want you to go into any struggle with him, please. If Ikena is a beast, then I am a demon. I am the devil's incarnate. No, no, okay? brother, you are not. Yes, I you am. You are not. You can't even hurt an insect. You took after our father. Our father was a beanie man. But Ikena... Oh, you are, I'm different now, okay? I'm expressly a changed person now. Listen, let me tell you. Ikena has dead my venom. He's gonna see me. He is gonna see me. Brother, please listen to me. I beg you, listen to me. Please. Ujuma, it's not possible. It's not possible. Sorry. Uh, sorry, sorry. Brother, please give ear to what I'm saying, okay? It is my right foot from Sinao. He has the control, oh no, who has joined the race for that? He has the final say, in this palace, niggas, niggas, ego, the nigga. Brother, who's on night? Be color for your life. How do you go? My dear, you need to have seen what happened at the palace. Eh? The civil war. Armageddon has broken out in the palace. They are killing themselves one by one. And you know what? What? Very soon, the road to the palace. The road to the palace. Oh, yes! Oh, yes! 
Yes. No, 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 it's the ox. Oh, yes. Of course, Daddy, I trust you. I know what you can do. Oh, yes, yeah. Look at you now. You're pulling the strings, yeah? You? Pulling the strings real good. Yes, you know me. And then when that happens, this kingdom will sit back and watch me with all the swags that I've got in stock for them. Mm. They'll watch me flaunt it. You look elegant. Shut up! <laughs> Shut up! You cry. Because I got it! No sense in jail, but girl, that nobody. She doesn't know how to flow what she's got. Oh. But she'll watch me do it. That's my dog talking. And then for me, you know, I will now look for a gorgeous, beautiful, well created and lady as my queen. You know, that will give me an offspring that will sit after me there. Ha! No, daddy. You marry again, though. Why? For what's that? Out with your daughter. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, you'll be the only daughter, okay? We shall not have female children. We have a female. I will ensure that. <laughs> I will ensure that because there is a way to do it. <laughs> <laughs> For your own safety. Please, I beg you to hear me out. I don't want to lose you now, please. Mother, I am going nowhere. I am going nowhere, Mom. In fact, I can't just understand you. Are you trying to advise me not to stand as a real man and fight for what rightfully belongs to me or what? Tell me! Mom, tell me! You know, it's said that what an elderly man sees sitting down, not even a child will see, even when he climbs the highest mountain. I know how powerful the hands behind Ikena is. Ono is capable of doing anything. His missions I don't know, but He's the one that sent those assassins. What he came as profess? Mom, don't. Kenya doesn't have the heart to harm you. Mom, don't just go there. He came now, did it. Uncle Nowu had no harm in this, man. Uncle Nowu had no harm in this, okay? It's obvious, man. It's obvious. Okay. It's obvious, man. Whosoever is responsible, what you should understand is that people don't like it. They don't want to see you alive. So you need to go take refuge somewhere for now, please. Mother, look, what we should be talking about now is what to do to get Ikena off the throne. Because I'm beginning to lose patience, okay? Don't even advise me to run for Ikena. I will never dare it. Mom, I am a man. And this is a manly struggle. I must fight it to the end with my last blood. Mom, I'm not going to accept what I am not done for. I will never. I will never, Mom.
in KG. I've been waiting for you since. What is wrong with him? What is wrong with him? Okay, too. What is wrong with him? Okay, what kind of a joke okay, is this now? Okay, come. What kind of a joke is this? Convince me that Ikena was behind your attack. Irrespective of the fact that you claim me as what is your rightful inheritance. That is not enough for him to plot any sort of evil against you. I don't think he will do that. Uncle. You, you don't seem to understand what I am talking about. Okay, okay. Could you believe that for the eight good weeks I spent in the hospital, he cannot never visited me even for a single day? What? Yes, he never did. He never did. All he could give us an excuse was that he was bloody busy with activities and useless meeting. Can you imagine that, man? Because as the present Iwe of Umuife Kingdom, it is expected that he's going to be engaged with activities and other important things within the palace. Though, that is not enough for him not to visit you in hospital, at least for one day. Yes. To know how you're faring. Mm, yeah. I will not support that. That is it. That is it. I will that. Yes. He refused to come because he never knew I would survive his plot. Uncle, let me just open up to you because I, I can't hide you my feelings. Ikenna has dared me. He's going to see me this time around. He must see me this time around! Uh, 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 don't, uh, please, it is not that. Don't come to that, please. Say that. I must fight Ikenna with the last drop of my blood! You dare not, Uzumba. Ikenna, you are going to see me this time around. I promise you! Well... Brother... You are a little fly. And I am gonna crush you. Ikena! What do you think you are? Who do you think you are? Ikena! Trust me, I'm gonna waste you with Oxford style, man! I'm gonna waste you! Yes! Hey! 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 Ikenna, stop it! I'm gonna waste you with us first time. Man, stop it! I say! I'm gonna waste you! I'm gonna drop you! What's wrong with you? Osana! I said stop it right now! Well, I'm standing. I 
chicken. Oh. Igwe. You see that your brother is up. Something inside of me tells me he has plans. And the earlier we cage him up, the better for us. I noticed. You're right. Well, you know what the problem is? I don't know my next line of action. You know, I tried before. And it failed woefully, so right now, I'm trying to be careful. Because the people are watching. Mm -hmm. So I ask you, what do I do? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Um, Igwe, I, 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 let me get home, okay? And sleep over it. I'm sure by tomorrow I will have thought about something. So see me in the house tomorrow. Hmm? See me tomorrow. You will. Chima, Chima, I've been thinking about something. What? What have you been thinking of? Chima, don't you think I should be doing something? Eh? Listen, I, I don't like being idle. Moreover, I don't know how long I'll be staying here. Eh? I need to start doing something so I can make money for myself. Yeah, honestly, it's a reasonable idea. I've been thinking about it too. But the only reason why I've not implemented it is because I've not come up with anything reasonable for you to do. And again, I don't want you to get yourself involved in any business that will expose you to the people. Uh, okay, in that case, why don't you teach me how to weave all these baskets I've been watching you weave? Or, or teach me how to do something so I can sell and make money? Eh? Yeah. Yeah. I'll be I'll be very very grateful if you teach me how to do something because I don't want to remain idle. I don't like it. Eh, Pochima, ah, how do I how do I go out to sell those things since I'm not supposed to be seen outside? Even now, that one is not a problem now. Mm. Huh? Uh -huh. Uh, on every market day, anything you are able to do, be it basket or candle range. Mm. I'll take them along with my own and I'll go and sell them. Huh? Yeah. But you, <laughs> you've not learned how to weave basket or break candle. Are you thinking of selling it? What do you want to sell? Uh, what, what, huh? I can't do that. I do. I, I've, I've been here. I like money too me. much. I have to do something. You know, like Rego. I have to start doing something. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm doing something. <laughs> I'm doing something. 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 I'm doing something.
and so? Can, can't you say you're sorry? Kotsi demands you. You say you're sorry. Can't you just open your mouth and say I am sorry? Say What's it gonna sorry. take you? For coming here to see your miserable life? <gasps> I managed to come here in this dilapidated environment to see you. I don't blame you. That's why you can open your mouth to whine. But obviously, I did wrong by coming. And you know what? I have better people to see at better places. Excuse me. Ancestor, for how long do you remain silent? Eh? People come and fight for your people. For what is greater than all who have overpowered us? Or do you want us to die and perish before you do something? People come and fight for your people. Come and fight for your people. Chambers? No, I checked everybody. There was no sign of him. 
What about his car? Is it out there? No, maybe he left it. Too bad. Where would he be at this time of the night? Why is Uzona so stubborn? He's not supposed to leave this palace without informing anyone. He knows that there is danger in the air right now. Oh my God. Where do I go searching for him at this time of night? Mother, Mother, just calm down. Let's oh. wait for a while, okay? Wait for a while? You said wait for a while? What is it by your time? Wait for a while. Okay. I'll wait. What about the guns? Oh, they said they didn't know what. What sort of trash is that? They don't know what. Mother! 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 Tell me you are coming. So I have to notify you before coming to see you. What do you want? Kechi, the question here should be, what are you doing here? How can you leave your husband's house and come here to live in Amrahman's house? What man are you talking about? That woman that calls himself a man? Let me tell you, any man that cannot provide for his family or fight for his family is not worthy to be called a man. As far as I am concerned, I know who has married me and there's nothing anybody can do about it. How can you call a man who took you away from your husband's house your husband? Kichi, do you know the shame you have brought to our family? Do you know what people out there are saying about you? Listen, let me tell you. You better go back to your husband's house and take care of him because he is sick. Listen, brother. Sorry to disappoint you. As far as I am concerned, I don't care what people out there are saying about me or about your family. Now I am married to the man that loves me, that can cater for all my needs and provide all I need in life. I am not going back to that wretched fool you call a man. It's your husband that you are calling hopeless and wretched. Who did this to my sister? What goes up must come down The first shall be the last And the last becomes the first All the wicked ones Yeah, this are numbered Princess, I don't 
know why you only had to commit suicide. Is it not because of Ikena and Uncle Nohu's wickedness? He couldn't bear it any longer. <laughs> only God would judge Ikena and Uncle Nohu for all the evil they've committed in this community. <laughs> they will never go unpunished. <laughs> I don't know what I did to Onu. Onu who turned Ikena's heart against her family. Ikena. He's no longer the son that I used to know. He's more like a devil. I'm so afraid of my own son. Mother, ever since Ikenna took over the throne, everything has been changing from bad to worse. He has succeeded in disrupting the whole kingdom. Everything is in great turmoil. Will the gods ever forgive him? <laughs> I got uh, words from uh, the DPO that uh, that idiot, that non-entity, Mazibe, has joined his ancestors. <laughs> so they finally carried out the assignment of terminating him. Why not? It's money talking. Money talking. <laughs> See how that bastard will live after murdering my old man. Bloody asshole. <laughs> you know, it got me thinking. I, you know, like maybe someday some some government may come up and grant him freedom. So I wanted it done fast. I thought as much too, you know. Because you know these governments and the way they behave. They might just come and before you know it, they say they are releasing some prisoners. You know, so I quickly instructed the DPO to finish him up. Yeah. Initially, he was a little bit reluctant, you know, but when I greased his palm, <laughs> he quickly succumbed. That is why I love you, Uncle. I said, nigga. <laughs> you get all things fixed. I said, nigga. It's nothing. It's nothing. Ujuma, will I ever see you again? Huh? You will see her, okay? Ujuma is fine. 
The gods will protect her. And I know you will see her again. Chima, that girl was nice to me. That girl showed me true love. I know. I know. But believe me, you will see her again. I believe it so much. Okay? So let's walk. As you can see, there is a lot of work to be done here. Huh? Come on, we got work to do now. Hmm? I have lots of work to do here. Send for me, Mom. Yes, my son. My son. Now that you have become the bona fide Igwe of this kingdom, I want you to emulate your father's president. Your father was a good man, loved by every member of this kingdom because of his good governance. I really want you to be the true son of your father. Hmm. Well, Mom, you don't seem to understand the true meaning of leadership. Good leadership. It's hard to please everyone. Remember how insatiable human beings can be. Now my dad, my dad, he... He was a different person altogether. But me, Mom... Me... I'm unique. Special. You don't expect me to follow in Dad's footsteps, do you? And what matters Mom, is that I maintain good and strong leadership. That is exactly what I'm encouraging you to do. In addition to that, son, there is something I want you to do for me. Shoot. Bring in a wife. Start up a family. If you don't want this throne to depart from this family. Mom, that is not really the issue. The issue is who to bring in. How do you mean? What about all these beautiful girls that flock around you? Look for the best among them. Come on, Mom. There is no best among them. All those little girls, they're just village dancers. You don't expect me to pick one of them as a wife, do you, Mom? Then look for a decent girl and marry. Or do I do that for you? Thanks for your concern. I'll take care of it. All I need right now is time. Time? Yes, time. <laughs> All right, if you're done, can a brother take his leave now?
No. What is it you seek of Ichoku? Great one. I have come to know if this is the right time for me to take over the throne. Patience. Patience. Ichoku urges you to be patient. But, 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 uh, great one. But haven't I been patient enough? I have applied the easy method you asked me to apply. But it's not giving any positive result. Why the delay? Are you questioning the wisdom of the gods? I know. I know. <laughs> Remember, only the patient dog eats the father's bone. Do not plug your apple before it is ripe. Else, it end up a waste. You shall take over the throne in due time. I can hear it. The voice of the gods. The voice that strikes like thunder and fire. The voice of our ancestors. Yes. The great spirit of the Iroko. But I can never go back to that kingdom. Unless you people intervene. Go first. Go. Go and fight for your people. For your people are in bondage and they need your intervention. Go. 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 In all these atrocities they are committing in this kingdom, why should the gods of our land sit and watch evil men take over our kingdom? Right. Not the brother. I say not the brother. Because I know that the days of the evil ones are numbered. And that is my happiness. They will come and end. The God of our land will fight Received information that a stubborn he got in Jaku is back in this kingdom. I want it to go. Seize him, kill him, behead him, and bring his head to me. He has dared the lion, and he shall see the bite.
There is trouble in the land. But the snakes that try to bite the tortoise will end up biting the shell. Yeah.
The surrogate dance should know that the dance is meant for the spirits. The worms eat up the ground and the fowl swallows it. The fowl dress the lion and challenges it. Go! 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 For the battle line is drawn. For today, we shall know among the two totties which is the male and the female. Go! Go! Go!
Please take heart. Mm -hmm. <sighs> take heart. because of this hmm? take heart take heart to go there Call me the elders. I'm not a I'm not a You're here, What 
is it? Mom, what is it? I killed him, boy. Hey! hey! No, he didn't. It was me that killed him, boy. I deceived you, can to kill us all his brother. Hey! <laughs> I also killed Ono and his wife. Hey! Nine. Hey. 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 I instigated the allegation on the son. He did not rape any. He did not rape anybody at all. I told Mazoya that I told him that's it. Hey! Hey! I did all these things because I wanted the truth for my family. Yeah. I wanted the truth for my family. Please, please. Please, you people should help me because you forgive me. Please, beg the gods to forgive me. Please, please, I am sorry. 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 I Oh no! Don't! Don't! Don't do this! 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 It is only the stubborn flies that follows the corpse to the grave. For the days of the evil ones are numbered. I saw it coming. Wait for us. No! Nietzsche! Help me with my father! No! 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 My son, what you cannot reject is the offer from the gods. No! No! They killed my father! Why must my father die of something he knows nothing about? They, they killed my siblings! They have deprived me of my family! And yet you call them my people! I completely disagree with you, Joko. My son, this is an offer from the gods. And remember, you have no place to run to. Obina, I think he's right. 
Shima. I will never step my legs into that land. I give you my word. I think it's high time you gave this a second thought. Chima. If it is about going back to that land, forget it because I am not interested. Obina, I want you to listen to words of wisdom. It's unreasonable to think that we are not being controlled by our destiny. You see, you are destined to be in Chima. Was losing my family part of my destiny? Is that what you're trying to make me understand? See, be strong, okay? Be strong and courageous. Accept whatever thing nature has brought your way. us that the gods are going to choose the new Igwe. So why the delay? Haven't they found someone else? Mazishiokwe, do not run faster than your shadow. The gods are not sleeping over this kingdom. For the gods have chosen the man to rule this kingdom. Hmm? And here it is. Life. Oh my God. The eyes of the gods. Oh my God. No. The, the eyes of the gods. It can't be true. Oh my God. Not the late Mazi Ibeson. Oh, he is mistress. He is dead. He's not dead. He's alive. But he found favor in the sight of the gods. And that is why the gods spared his life. Oh my god. Oh god, thank you. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Obina. Oh. Obina. It is the choosing one. Hold it up. Here are your people. Oh, you're welcome, my son. My queen. You're welcome. You're welcome. My others, I greet you all. My queen, I greet you. You're welcome, my son. My princess, my love, I greet you. My people, I greet you all. Yeah. <laughs> 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 the eyes of the gods. <laughs> 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 
Ne baş? Bana mı?
What are you doing in my house? Biko. Nkechi? Nkembiko. What are you doing in my house again? Biko. Nkechi? Biko for you. What are you doing in a poor man's house? You are not a poor man. Nkegi? You say what? Nkegi? Nkem. Nkegi? Nkem. Nkechi? You are a disgrace to your family. Nkechi? You left me when I was sick, thinking that I will die. Nkechi? No. I thank God, Almighty God, that He, he, he let me. I say, may your name be held exalted in the name of Jesus. All the while I was praying for you. you. Oh, prayer warrior. I was praying for you. You are praying for me? You don't know whose bedroom. Prayer warrior. Only a parrot. Nche nigga. Nche nigga. He charmed me. He charmed me. Oh no, nigga charmed me. Come on, tell us this. Please, my husband, forgive I me, please. Go. I please. don't want to marry you again. Please. I don't want to. Okay, you go. I said go. I said go. Please. I, I will be break your head now. Go. Go. Go, Mario. Go. 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 I said go. I will break your head. Go, go, go. Women. Women. Nobody to trust in this world. Has come home, oh, oh, be more. 
So you are the choosing one. Look one who just like that. Obi na borogo igwe. Ewo, 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 ewo. The last is not the first. Oh. Uh-huh.